your style and your flavor make the city rock. They must say the season come out with a bang. Coach Minzy, best round here. Remember that. All right, people, well, go on. Bless up on yourself. Yeah, man, we are here to uh, review the Tom Jones Invitational uh, Trap Meet. Like I told you before, we were here yesterday and we had a wonderful time. You understand? So we are here today again to talk about the Tom Jones Invitational, the final day, day two of the competition and trust me today's competition was epic you understand it was epic you understand so people welcome to the welcome to the show yeah man jump on quick and fast share the live people share the live so i'm going to be sharing the the life um yeah so we had pump people for forward yeah people Yeah, man, we'll try to share a life. Share up a life, people. Welcome, everyone. Welcome, welcome. You know, we have to do the pre pre preliminaries so people can forward. Big up to the people on Facebook. Facebook Massive. Big up yourself. Big up to the Facebook Massive in the building. Hold on, let me. I try to reach the video, people. Sir Mike C, what are going on? Mike C, big up yourself. Where is it? Sears to the world. You feel good, eh, Mike C? Mike C. You know, sister, may I, may, I, may, I, may I mess up a thing? Anyways, people, yeah, man, we are here, we are here. And we hope to have a good discussion. All right, people, so I'm going to share the live. Welcome again to everyone. Welcome again to everyone to the, sh to the show. Thanks very much for tuning in. That is the question in a mic, see. That is the question, Um, basically. Sorry, sorry for, for, for hiding you there, mic, see. Kirk King, what go on? Big up yourself, you know. Opinion, what go on? YouTube, send out the notification and stop it playing. Facebook massive, big up on yourself. YouTube, send out the notification and stop the playing YouTube. What oh, YouTube are going with? The 
get what I mean, I said. Mike, see, you want to call in the people who can hear you. Give us a breakdown on, on, on the meat. Mike, see, give us a breakdown on the meat now. Sports circle, big up yourself, you know. People, the phone line is open, you know. Where is the Adidas to the world? <laughs> right now, me and me Adidas, you know. Come on, Flatch. See it there? You know, Adidas, come on, Flatch. Yeah, man. So, we rate the Adidas kit, them. Adidas kit, them always bad, man. You understand? But, J3 have to make them own decision. <laughs> Mike C, no, 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 no wrong, you know, no, no wrong, you know. Good things come to those who wait, you see me, I say. So the thing set, man. Good things come to those who wait. King said, so Adidas to the world. And he, he, he work around school where we are straight. Um, poor man. No? <laughs> so, you want me to send out people? Here, what me to say? <laughs> hey. I go pick a little bone with Noah Lyles, you know, because Josiah Sears ran 10.77. See? Noah Lyles, you get the wind reading where you need. Positive 1.6. And you couldn't go sub 10. Nah, man, a poor performance, man. Poor performance. Poor performance, Noah Lyles. Noah Lyles, you flop. I tell you straight. I yard the man. You're supposed to dip below. People are going to tell me it's a season open and all of these things. I don't want to hear that when it come on to Noah Lyles. Because it looks like the same measurement that is used for other athletes. It is not used for Noah Lyles. You see me, I say? So, Uno shouldn't use that same measurement for him. Noah Lyles in that condition, at that track, him supposed to run sub 10. If I even want 999, 995. You see me, I say? Yeah, man, he should have run sub 10, man. I don't care what people want to say right now about him not, you know, having a season opener yet. This is a season opener, early in the season. I, I bet if him did run it, Uno would not say that. So when him not run it, me I call feet. Me know the intricacies of, of, of the track and field, man. Me know X, Y, Z. But me I pressure Noah Lyles. Mm -hmm. And you know, our next thing with Noah Lyles, you know, so he might go on and go on till the real estate run out upon him. Yeah, man, the truck will get, the truck will get shot upon him, man. You watch. You see them run, run back. Run back the way he might go on with an weight pan. It will catch up upon him. It will catch up on Noah Lyles. Yeah, man. Definitely, I think it will catch up on Noah Lyles. You understand? And him get the condition so he should have run fast. See there? If Mike C agree with me, no people, Mike C no normally agree with me, no. You see, if Mike C agree with me, 
then certainly me can say without the shadow of a doubt that we, we may say have whole per merit. Can me and Mike see ever a war now? <laughs> Opinion. You know me now by the early argument there. So, Lindsay we run 19 8. It's too early. The girl will run 10 7. It's too early. All I'm saying, opinion, is that the conditions were there. The conditions were there for him to run fast. No one has a struggle. If you if, if, if catch up back, um, Kung Fu Kenny. You see me, I say, based on the conditions, he should have easily run sub 10. I mean, I'll take back my talk. <laughs> What I'm going to do, I'm going to take back my talk. T, you are going. Big up yourself, you know. Yeah, man, no one likes disappoint me, man. Disappoint me. All the bugger talk and the hype around no one likes. With the conditions that were there. Man, man should have run um, sub 10, man. Mm. Man should have run sub 10. No allies out of everybody should have run something. Who do not tell me nothing? Who do not tell me nothing? You get what I say? Who do not tell me nothing? T, you don't have to ask me that, man. If you just ask me for the link. <laughs> If you just ask me for the link, yeah, man, no, no, all that's performance crappy, man. And you know why I talk about it, so I see some of them little, what I call it now, goons, them are hype him up, you know, after that lackluster performance, them are hype him up. Like he, he did something extraordinary. No. A full full performance that. I mean, I don't care what the guy has said. Full full performance. I have this thing going. Close this. Okay. Hi, everyone. Sorry, I was closing the. Um... Oh, no, the... oh, I forgot to have to put that in the headset now. Hello everyone, good night. It's been a while, it's been a bit. How is everyone doing? I had fun today. I enjoyed today's um today's meet. Um I heard you talking about Noah Lyles. I asked you to come on because I wanted to say something in relation to Noah Lyles. Um because it reminded me of something I was saying earlier on in the season. So I I, I want to go back to the indoors when when we were talking about Noah Lyles going crazy fast. What was it? Six four three? Is that the fastest he's gone or six four one? Right. Mm. Um. And people were talking about how he starts is is so much better. And I said I recall saying at that time that no, based on how he's running the race, you can tell that he is hitting his top speed earlier than he typically would hit his top speed, which means that when he gets outdoors, he's going to have to retransition to how he typically runs. And the 60 would absolutely mean nothing for his 100 meters. And in the first race, you can clearly see there's absolutely no change in his running style. Absolutely none. 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 None whatsoever. And I said None. it because you could clearly see getting up out of the blocks faster and being able to drive through to a 60 doesn't necessarily mean it's going to help you in a 100 meters because in the 100 meters, you still have to go through all those phases. You still have to go through that drive phase, which you typically won't go through, I assume, in the 60. Or some people don't do it. I've seen some people do it and they're good at it. I've seen Elaine do it, drive and still run a fantastic 60. For everybody else, you pretty much have to be up and going. You know what no, I mean? No, but T, so, no, no allies did not start well in the 60, and he still not start well in other 100 meters yet. No, so not, I'm, not saying, I'm not saying he started I, well. You know, I'm saying people are saying because he's gotten better at the 60 means it's going to help. The, it's, he's going to be know, so much better over the one. I was like, no, you know, that's not going to happen. And first race, right off the bat. Flop. Flopping flop. You know why I'm saying flop to you? You probably didn't hear me. Mm -hmm. 
Noah Lyle has got the perfect condition. Everybody run fast. So it, well, when I say everybody, the ladies them take the thing by the scruff of the neck. At least three ladies run sub 11. And that I show you, sir, based on how the condition was, they exploited the conditions. Why no allies never do it? Because in those crappy, in two phases, then... No, I won't, I won't knock him so hard. I won't knock him so hard because it's the first run and, and, I, and I'm just looking at it from that perspective. You know what why I may will knock say... him to you? You know why mm -hmm. may I knock him? In front, a high popular 10.01. In front, so. In friend over a YouTube channel there. You don't know in friend, man. Ray? <laughs> no, man. Not no Ray, man. Would I, would, would, would I... The incognito brother, man. And I only place a see, man. Now I like sh show you see him, man. When name again? Total. I don't know that. Total running production, man. Oh! Man, a high pop look of performance. Missy. You know something I don't watch it. Me don't watch it, but I saw his title when he said no one yeah. did something insane or crazy or something. I mean, I said to myself, say, I want my talk about. He my hype it up. So guess what? You see me kind of hype it up. Me, I don't play it. No, I didn't watch the video, but I could tell what it was about just based on, you know, he I'm assuming this is what it was about. That the fact that he ran down the field based on how bad the start was, which is mm. typically what he usually does. But that isn't amazing because if you're going to all right, let's just, let's just say happenstance, right? Somebody runs 10 6. I mean, 9 6, right? There's only so much you can run down people and no more. You understand what I'm trying to say? And based on his current um, execution, technically, he will not be able to run down somebody that is going, you know, much faster than he has, you know, gone, you know, in previous years, right? So I don't know what the hype is right now, but uh, for me, I'm still not knocking him because it's the first run. So I want to see them build off here. What I did say, because I have a video coming out, I decided I'm going to put it out in the morning because I did so many videos earlier. So I said, I'm going to wait until in the morning to drop that video. So guys, look out for that. But anyway, what I did say in my video was, based on the wind, that should have been an easy sub 10. That was what so I was that, saying. So that, that may I pray too? Wind, it should have been an easy sub 10. It's the same thing I said about Fred Curley. Yeah. Fred Curley ran the same 10 0 1. And I said, based on the wind, it should have been a sub 10. But since it's the first race, I'm going to let it slide. Right. And we see how it goes from there. That's what I would say. But, uh huh. No, listen, Dandy, would not be no hypocrite. We are taught the facts. <laughs> we are taught the facts. There's no hypocrisy in this talk. T said, she said she it in her video, and I see him think me as a writer. So, based off the condition, no ally should have run 10.9, 9.9, or 9.95 easily. My thing is, right, Dundee, you're mixing up what's happening here. What did you notice about Noah Lyles' execution over 60? All he did was start faster, right? He didn't, there was no drive face to speak of that you would speak of when you get to the 100 meters versus when you look at a Sherika Jackson, you could see Stephen Francis slowly but surely making sure that that drive phase was getting to where it needed to get yeah. to. And she, she incrementally got better over the 60. It was to the point where I was saying, oh my God, it feels like I'm looking at Elaine Thompson here. Now, if you guys go back in the day and watch when Elaine Thompson here used to run the 60 when she was at Stephen Francis MVP and look how Sherika runs the 60, it's the same exact way and i remember looking at them from a headshot one day and i said to myself oh my god it's like i'm looking at a mirror copy of elaine in terms of the execution based on what steven did with sharika so it's two different things it is two different things you understand what i'm saying so that's not what happened with noah lyles and i pointed it out earlier on in the season and i said you guys are not looking at the bigger picture where is the dry face to speak of there's none based on his 60 meter performances so yes he has gotten faster but it looked like, it, I don't know, I, how, how would you explain it? Child, I don't even know the technical term for it. But anyway, coach, you're supposed to understand what I'm saying, right? It, it wasn't going to really, you know, make him that much faster over the 100 meters. Because him not, him not, him get faster over 60 meter, yes, which, which would be the maximum. Be upon be a a you running a 100 meters, the 60 meters basically is the, you, you reach your, 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 top, your top speed at 60 meters. All you're going to do, I try to maintain to the, finish, to the next 40. And because Noah's strong, 
he might have a better top end speed than everybody else. So he might decelerate slow. So him, and that's why he always catches people. Right? So what athletes have to work on is their strength so that they can maintain their top speed their top speed a little bit longer. So Dandy. What do you mean she's talking crap? You said no, but I'm curious. Would not help for Isn't no that the same lives. thing? You said would not. What if he ran fast? Me not, me not understand Dandy. Me not know if you understand. Point Dan, the point Dandy is, I said the 60 meters based on my observation would not change his 100 meter execution. And based on this first race, I'm saying to you that clear as day, it has not changed his 100 meter execution. What exactly are we saying? I don't know. <laughs> you, you, you know what I am saying? Based on the condition of today's meet, Noah lives should have run faster than that 10.01 he should have run 10 point um 9.9 .9. anyway not the 9.9 .9 bracket at that me i say i'm gonna hear the box story and whatever transpired before dandy this is what i am saying <laughs> him should have run and what caused him not to run it what do you think said make him not run it what do you think not make him run it dandy now the execution, he's stung in our blocks. With him poor start. I always feel that's why I say um earlier, you know, real estate are gonna run out for no lives. Make him stay there. Real estate. Is there Mike saying he has him. no drive phase? He had zero drive phase coming out of the box. Exactly. So None. I'm not sure what any everybody is going on and on about. So when I say we are hypocrite dandy, you know, you know what you think, you know understand, you know look like you understand the thing. When and I think it's an unfair field, comparison to you, emotions. Sharika, really, because you've seen Sharika's dry face get so much better. So much better from when she started the 100 meters in 2000 and what was that, 21 versus no, her dry face is ridiculous in comparison to what it, um, in, in terms of what it was when she was just starting out. And that's where you can clearly see 60, a 60 meter focus helping your 100 meters, right? It's not just about, and I use, I tend to use this word a lot, force running it, right? And sometimes what I, the vibe I get, some of these athletes, they're trying to force run it and not necessarily execute, uh, um, execute the phases, right? Once you execute the phases, in my opinion, then yeah, the times will come, right? But I feel like if you try to go around it and like shorthand it and just force run it and you get the first time, yeah, but then, you know, there's not no real meat behind it. I don't mean, understand what you're saying. Me and T agree, says, is six, um, I don't know, 60 meter wouldn't help for no lives. When, 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 when did we agree that? No, I don't know when you said it, but I know I said it. I, I said it during indoors that I was watching him technically. And I said, based on how he's executing that 60, it's not going to help his 100. That's what I said. Right. And based on this first run, I mean, you can't clock me and say I was wrong. <laughs> so you're I'm not, not sure what yeah, you're not wrong for sure. So, so, so what did he do in the 60 meters that would say it, it would have helped? Yeah, he run faster, he's saying improve, but make we see transition in I 100 for two after nothing wrong with that statement there. We need to see transition. I want see it, you know. There's some more see the transition. Um, yes, it's Javi saying he he that's true. He he remembers when I said it. I said it when everybody was hyping up the fast times. I said, focus on how he's executing the sixty. How he's executing that sixty will not help his one hundred. That is what I said. You understand? So I'm not sure exactly what um the confusion is. I'm not I'm not even understanding Dundee anymore. I'm kind of confused. Not, that's why I'm asking. I not understand why myself is true because what you said is correct because his execution in the sixty yes in in get faster. We can't go around that. But the execution is different from the timing. That's Dundee, the point. If you're not understanding. And if he had done better in his execution, which was the same execution in Mabina 60, if he had done better, he would have run that sub um, 10 where we are looking for. That's what I believe. So yes, me and T agree upon that. If I that you talk. Execution different from the timing, boss, man. 
in in this um um scenario that we have mentioned. All right. Maybe Liza um, just had a bad race today. Um, yeah, that's fair. I guess that's a fair um comment to say, which is why I'm saying I'm not really knocking him that that bad based on the time here and the 10-0-1. But my opinion doesn't change on his execution. My opinion stays doesn't change that the 60 didn't help his 100. But in terms of the time, I'm not really knocking him because it's the first one. So let's see what happens as they progress. Opinion, what's the question? Are you saying that 60 meet 60 60 met start? I don't understand that. Um, Noah's dry phase is poor, trying to run 100 like a 60 meter as its limits. Mm hmm. My, him, and and he look like he passed 60, look like he might try to run it like a hurdler because the hurdlers them don't have no dry phase, so look like that he might try to. How could you say not? Dundee, me finish, me finish read your comments then now. Maybe Lies just had a bad race. They won me race to start the season. Listen, and you know why me I pressure him. I me I tell you know why me I pressure him. You know, me tell you know. The late Sears ran ten nine ten seven seven. Seeing, and the man got eye pop at ten zero one. No one tell me. Hmm. No one tell me. But me, when me oh, were you say, on my live the other day? Were you on my live the other day when I was talking about Total Running Production? No. Probably oh, because when? I was the saying on my live, somebody asked me something about him. And I said that. Because I, I, I watched him hard back in the day. I don't watch him as much now. Because what I find is that when you're a content creator, you can't watch as much as you used to. Right? But what I noticed is that after the whole, you saying Bolt, Jamaica, you know, dominance in the 100 meters. Mm -hmm. What I noticed is that he was actually slowly but surely showing his American bias, which is what I was, uh, I spoke to on my channel. I don't have mm -hmm. a necessarily have a problem with people being biased, but it's how he kind of masked it for years. And then out of nowhere, all of a sudden, you see him going ham on, you know, the Americans. And I'm like, well, clearly he was always, you know, Pro America, pretty much how I'm pro Jamaica, and I just keep going on and on and on about Jamaica. And I pointed it out and I said, Well, guess what? He's always been pro America. The problem was that Jamaicans were, you know, leading the charge when you talk about the sprints for 100 meters. Um, for the men at least, because, you know, even though the women were still doing their thing, people were ma mainly focused on the men, right? And he had no choice but to, you know, follow along. But now that America is in the driver's seat, like he mm -hmm. just keeps going on and on and on. I noticed about um, American performances sometimes. And I'm looking and I'm like, even the other day he was apologizing to Justin Gatlin. And I was like, okay, child. <laughs> what, what I'm saying is still enough. <gasps> well, everybody do them thing different still. Everybody do them thing different as, as content creators. Me probably have bias. You probably have bias. Everybody have their little bias. But yeah, I do. Some some people want us blatant. Blatant, blatant. Let me tell you, Mike C and, and Dandy, yeah, when I say, um, what you call it? Let's see, the Tibet and Tibogo are going to be the man or him and I'm Ed. Remember, let's see, the Tibet Tibogo as this, as quote unquote similar starting issues. So don't believe that Tibego I go I go run left no allies and uh, uh, um from the get go. Don't believe so. You understand? So me know so no want Tib Tibogo but Tibogo have to improve him first phase I'm race. I mean somebody say him him put out all the effort in other part of the race and then him 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 not have the energy for go home. No nothing like that. The first phase of your race that is where you accelerate. So that is where you're supposed that to go the fastest. If you start out slow and I try to run back, you get left. You understand? So you have to get going. That's why we, we, we try, um, especially when coaches are working with athletes, they, they work on their start repeatedly out of the blocks because you want them to hit that first part of the race. You hit the ground hard like a booming uh, 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 tennis ball when I hit it on the ground hard, it flies up. So you want to ensure so the athletes are hit the ground quick so them turnover can go as quickly as possible. That's why we call it drive phase or acceleration phase. So if Tibo is Tibo gonna improve this, so he might have a problem too.
I can I can definitely say I agree when it comes to um a lot of these athletes not um having and I think it goes down to coaching. One, I've struggled over the years with watching American athletes, and some of you Americans, you know, can sound off in the comment section and tell me your thoughts. But um, I've just watched a lot of Americans over the years, and I've always thought, why is it that from a technical perspective, they never seem to get any better at the craft, right? They may get faster, but technically, they never seem to get better. And it's something I've struggled with over the years. So I think it comes down to coaching. I think one, for, for one thing, it doesn't look like the Americans really focused on it that much. And two, I don't know who coaches that silly Tobogo, but he will need to, um, well, his coach or, you know, if he cho chooses to switch coaches at some point in his in his career, then he'll have to, you know, go to one that will be able to assist him in terms of just being better technically over his craft, right? And again, the better you are technically, the faster you will go. Yes, um, from a talent perspective, you, you are always going to improve as long as you don't get injured, right? But is that the furthest you could go? What would happen if you were better technically? I think it's something I talk about with Rashid Broadbell from a talent perspective. For me, he's definitely world world record caliber. But when I look at it, like he just looks like he has so much flaws to fix. And I'm like, if he's able to fix those things, it will be wild. Yes, he's running fast right now. Yes, he's doing amazing right now. But just imagine how much better he would be if he was able to fix those technical flaws. And that's the that's the that, that's the vibe, or that's how I take things when I look at the sprinting. So yeah, let's see. Little book has a lot to work on, in my opinion. And as I said. If anybody gets fast over the 100 meters, like, uh, you know, low 10, 7, maybe 10, 6, then um, they won't, they'll run out of room in terms of running, having the ability to run down anybody. You can only run down so much and no more, right? Look at Usain Bolt. When he was at the heights of his career, he was the best starter, even beating Asafa Powell out of the blocks, right? Everybody remembers 2009, right? Crazy. So when you think about... Um, at sprinters, the best that have ever done it. When you look at Elaine, when you look at Shelly, even Flo Joe herself, just when you look at these athletes, they were good technically over the event. And people shouldn't be complaining that we're saying technically you don't look like you're doing what you're not doing, you're not doing what you're supposed to be doing technically. Yeah, the technical part of the race is very important. I mean, talent wise, yes, you have persons that are going to run fast, like a Shakir. Shakir doesn't have the best um technique. Uh, she's not great technically, especially her her arms. However, she's doing other aspect that is causing her to run. And if she has, she's ever to clean up uh, the phases of her race. Trust me, she she gonna be more faster than she is right now because she's already fast without being that technical. And I hear somebody's um said it said it you know. Um, I think it's it's Corey Bennett when, when he was asked about it. He said if Alana Reed can run ten point nine two with a poor farm. Cause I, uh, somebody asked him the question about um why his athletes are not good technically. And he said if you can run fast and not and not technically sound, then give me the speed over the technicality. He said that, but I mean as as a coach, you are still want to um, try to instill your athletes to do the right thing in terms of your, your, their technicality. Some might will will never get it. Some might improve by a needle eye, but coaches always are gonna talk about that. Um, I didn't know he said that, but that's interesting. Um. I guess at the end of the day, um, it, all right, let's use Jay Shashir's, not to jump topics, but earlier, mm -hmm. and I, I said in my video that I've never really liked how she runs because she doesn't really look relaxed. But at the mm -hmm. end of the day, if that's getting you to the line, if that's making you win, then by all means, you know what I mean? So I guess from that perspective, sure. But I don't know, I guess from um, being sport, you always want to see people be the best they can be. And, and I guess, again, technicality is part of it. And I would love to see, especially some of the sprinters that you look at and you're like, Does, what would happen if they were ever supposed to fix, you know, certain things? How much faster would they be? You know, that's something that always, you know, runs through my mind, especially some of the athletes that are now retired that will no longer be able to perform. You you, you wonder what would have been if they were any better. Yeah, just uh, um, Sears runs a bit tense. Like, you know, she woke Where? up a little bit. Um, so definitely, if she can fix that, but if she's running that way, I'm going to tell her with sprinters. Yes, when they're running a particular way 
and they're running fast it is one of the hardest thing to try and fix that form so it is going to be difficult for her to run we tell the athletes don't run tense because uh the more tension you put um especially in your shoulders you, you, you give your muscles less oxygen and your arms are not going to be moving as fast as you want but she run the way there and she run 10 7 7 so what you gonna tell her say oh you need to improve this improve that you gonna have a very hard time doing that you understand donald griffiths um t you're talking rubbish where on earth did you may i dead for you get to it Powell so make can so make get pan donald <laughs> look here donald May I advise you, sir, please go watch 2009. Please go and watch back that world record race and tell me if Usain Bolt was not leading everybody, right? Tell me if Usain Bolt was not leading everybody in that race, which surprised most people because you the, everybody was looking to the Asafas, even the Tyson Gay to be leading him. No, it was Usain Bolt. Please, I advise you, go back and watch the race. And as I said, Usain Bolt at the heights of his prowess and the heights of his prowess was 2009. Um, the only the only issue I see with Shelly still in her um opinion is the fact that her her head tilt, she doesn't have that linear um look that you'd want to see, so yeah her form is not a hundred percent, and even Asafa and uh, 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 Maurice Green, I think two of the most technical male sprinters that 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 I've ever seen, Ilian would have been one of the um most technical from a female standpoint. And when you check it, they still have their local flaws, you know. You understand? So you you you'll never find everybody in in that line that you want them to be. And that's why it takes practice. That's why it takes them um repeating all of these stuff on a daily basis so that they can better it. You understand? So you see, and Bolt was never the best starter, but. The field has never left you saying bolt. I must probably now on semi-final now on first round where my joke it out. But come final, you see bolt is always the, uh, with them. I've never seen. Can anybody in the chat room tell me that you see bolt has ever run from back to win a title? And when 2012. I want me say back, he get a bad start, and in the fifth, sixth. This I 2012, 2015. I can't really tell you the number in terms of placing where he was, but I know he was behind in 2012 and he was behind in 2015 too. Yeah, but he wasn't fifth, sixth. Those are the numbers that I brought up, you know, fifth or sixth. Um, This is my thing when, I, when you talk about fifth, sixth. What if fifth, sixth is only separated by one hundredth of a second? Then that's not really anything to speak it of. Is still, I'm, it is I'm still looking at it as it relates to distance. Distance yeah, is what I was talking about. No, but it's 100 meters. You're not going to have a great distance between them. That's why I say the only time I see him do that are when he's in the blocks. I mean, left in the blocks. I think I him run down. Um, where, where you the name? See him, Christian Coleman. No, it wasn't Christian Coleman. It was um, 20, yeah, man, 20, Chris, 2015 Christian is Gatlin. I thought the final. I said in the first round or heat or semi final. The heat. Oh, the heat in 2017. Yeah. No, but still, think about it. In terms of the gap, that would be the greatest gap he would have suffered 2015 and 2000 and, um, and 2012. And he got back to win. 2017, he didn't have enough space to get back. Right, so that's what I'm trying to say. Regardless of how many people were in front of him, I'm still looking at the gap that it was, the, the gap that was ahead of him. Me, you know, see, you see, and Bolt have, a, have any deficit so big that him, 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 him in a FIFA or six position. You see, and Bolt has always been there. I'm never in a situation where I'm in a great deficit. I never say that. Never. Only time I see it, I went time him, him almost left in high blocks, and him have a hustle because catch by Christian Coleman. I think I now a semi final. 
in 2012, in terms of numbers, he was behind Johan, Tyson, Justin. What's the other guy's name? The one that I can never remember his name. <laughs> Ryan Bailey. That's all. He was behind all of these people in 2012. Right? That's for sure. Um, again, in 2015, the field matters. So if you have weaker people in the field that are not re running really fast, then I don't think it counts. I don't think it matters. I think it's relative to, you know, the gap that the person has on you again. So 2012 and 2015 for me stand out. Yeah, what's the race to right now, you know? 2012. 2012 bolt the right there. Right there. I'm not gonna watch the race the back. I'm not gonna watch it. Me I watch it right now. Actually, we can't show up on the screen. Gatlin got a good start. Bolt was right there. Bolt was right there. If Bolt never the right there, he couldn't run 9.6. It's so funny that you say that because um, I'm on a particular video that has a screenshot. And the screenshot literally has Usain Bolt behind Justin, behind Johan, behind Tyson, behind Asafa as well. Screenshot um, is not and the who best. Was that? Screenshot who is that is in the first the plane? Thing. What's that, what's that um, Trinidad and Tobago athlete name again? The one that medal in 2008. You. Listen. Screenshot is not the best thing to judge that. Screenshot is not the best thing. The best thing to do is look on a side on view when them just get out of the block. I can't really that look is... on a side on view like that. I tend to look at the lines on the track, right? To see where each athlete is. And coming out, you saying Bolt was behind. As a matter of fact, Asafa and Justin were out there gone, right? And Johan as well. You saying Bolt was behind at least uh, all of the guys to his inside, he was behind. All of the guys to his inside. That's what it looks like to me. Coming out the blocks, he was behind them all. If you go back to the first line on the track, he was behind them all. Everybody to his inside. Gatlin got the best start. Me not, me not look for a screenshot because screenshot I go show. See, see, the, listen to the commentator when he say, Bolt got a very good start, but it was still not the best. Um, listen what the you, commentator you, say. Comment <laughs> you see, when it comes to me and commentary, um, some you have what i would say is a preconceived notion as it relates to what your expectation is so i don't know if sometimes you hear a, a, a um a commentator say um and there is richardson but when you look richardson is not doing what you're supposed to see richardson doing right and i've heard that many times because they already come in with an expectation to see Shelly really shut out to the blocks because that's what she's known for, right? So you're expected to say that. Oh, let me use a perfect example. Let's go back to 2021 and let's talk about Sportsmax's coverage of the women's 100 meter finals um, at the Olympic Games. L L Lance's name is Lance had an idea as it relates to where Shelly should have been. So he was saying because it's already something that he prepped himself for Shelly there. But when you look at the chat, that's not what you're seeing, right? And he had to adjust himself after when he realized that, oh no, it's actually Elaine. You understand what I'm saying? So I don't need to listen to commentary like that because if my eyes is suddenly different from what you're saying, then I'm not gonna necessarily go with what you're saying. I am saying you saying bold. Didn't get a, a good start before. Didn't get a bad start before me hear the commentary. And uh, the the commentary the commentator started to say that in the um re, um what you call it the repeat of the race. You see the angle where we are say that angle will always trick us. The angle where we are say. You see the people them. You see the people them to the to the to the and uh, that's why everybody they think say uh, Shakiri. Did the way back and now appear in the mind because of the angle where we did that see from all them set up the thing. No, so I agree with that my um, in terms of the angle, which is why I said the line on the track. But however, however, coach, let's just agree to disagree because you know. No, we can't agree to disagree. T. 
<laughs> How you people can't agree to disagree? You know, so, you know so that statement there, a rubbish statement. <laughs> oh, this is a rubbish statement. We're moving on. So we don't well, agree. Better we on, say we are moving on. On our views. Let us let So us we're agreeing agree that we don't agree. So we're moving on. Oh, that yes. makes sense. <laughs> it makes a lot of sense to me. So we disagree no, on the point, right? And we're going to agree to the fact that we dis we disagree to that particular point and we're moving on. Anyways. Squid Squidward, big up a cell. Where you said that 1077 now gonna turn eleven one by August. You could be right, of course. Because we know it go. But depending on how them 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 basically use the athlete. See 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 the coach that I use Br Brianna very sensibly. The man pull her out of the four by four, you know. Yeah. He pull her out of the four by four. So it depending on how the coach them decide if he use the athlete. If them go off a championship, then they know say she gonna run a lot of races, which is right. You understand? So me understand that. So even though it might change, I think it was a good run from her today. She ex and she exploited the conditions. And that's what I wanted Noah Lies to do. Exploit the condition. I might him say I Noah Lies are the world best. Exploit the condition as the world best. And run sub sub ten in your first race. And then would have an argument say, yo, Noah Lies is prim and ready. For the event. You understand? <laughs> Ram Smith, you go on, man. <laughs> Big up yourself, Ram Smith. But, anyways, I think this meet, this meet was an awesome meet in terms of, um, what you call it? Day two was very good. This meet basically it Miramar meet or the park by far. Performances, world leads. Which meet is that, coach? The Tom Jones. Tom Jones. This no, meet. which meet did you say? Hit it out of the ball, the, the ballpark? One something up of Florida near Miramar. You know, I don't know that any such meet I keep. You sure? You sure you're yeah, not man, confused? That, that's, that's something there, man. That's why I said that's something there. <laughs> <laughs> no hope Ilian had the best form. So no that me did say Ilian have the best form. Technically. I know that me did say. <laughs> Sharon, what <are> God? <laughs> what you say? Do you say look, no meat never keep a Miramar? Why Florida meet that Miramar meet the flop? Cantonville go on a bug of things to them, I tell you. I really Really, really um like this meet. The at least them really support. Um, I think Alana really came back and you know did her thing. Because from that great, great opening run from Alana. Great opening run from Alana. With that lackluster performance and she come back on run eleven o. That is that is commendable. And and as as Corey Bennett said last week, you know, Corey Bennett said. Him now watch the run there because the run there is it, it, it was just disappointing. But him just believes that Alana will get it but get it together and come back. And see there, she do it right away. But one other thing we have to talk about in you know, tea. You see that camp there? Star Athletics Camp. We have to start pre them, you know. Oh. We have to start pre them. Dennis Mitchell a uh, cook things up a uh, uh, star athletics. They might go out a bag of things. 19-8. Eh? They might go out a bag of things. And Shakir now what me? You know, it's interesting because I was watching Cor the Courtney Lindsay guy. Mm. And I was thinking to myself. <laughs> no wonder last week when I was there um, grumbling about Akeem Blake's 10-8. Look here, I don't care who ran the 10-8. The 10-8 to me was not acceptable. Right. Um 10, I mean not 10 eight, sorry, 10 two, eight. The 10 mm. two, eight was not acceptable. Right. But um I remember somebody, I think it was I don't remember who Diamond Chuck Diamond, I think, was saying to me that Courtney Lindsay is um pretty good. Right. I don't know who I think I have Courtney Lindsay confused for somebody else in my mind. Is there another Courtney Lindsay? 
Because in my mind, I think there's probably somebody that, with a similar name. But anyway, it was interesting that seeing I him know. run that 1988 because I was like, okay, this is interesting. Um, America is definitely um, blowing that 200 meters wide open, mm -hmm. um, it seems. It seems that 200 meters is, is, is going to get blown wide open. As a matter of fact, the 100 meters, the because 100. we saw... We saw um my guy there right behind Noah Lyles in the same race at the same time. Kenny. Um, what's his name? And he Kenny. said he's doubling. Yeah, mm -hmm. Kenny. And Kenny said he's doubling. So it's it's gonna be an interesting year. As I, I keep talking about how Jamaica is gonna be crazy, but America is gonna be crazy too. I mm -hmm. mean, wild, wild, wild. Do I think there's anybody really gonna be absolutely crazy when it comes to the women apart from Shakiri? I expect to see some really good performances, but I don't think I'll see anything as good as a 10-6 from Shakiri. Let's put it that way from an American perspective. I, I, I think I'll see some other good performances, but I don't think we'll see 10-6 good. You know what I mean? Whilst on the other hand, you know, we have, as long as the, the, the Jamaicans are healthy. You, you mean at their, their championship? Have, yeah, their championship. A track tour, not you know. I don't know. 10-6, let me tell you something. I will never underestimate 10-6. I will never underestimate 10-6. 10-6 is ridiculous. You know, one, at one particular point, 10-7 was the barrier, right? And it was so hard. And think about it even now. The same amount of people are still still can't break into 10-7. 10-7 10, 10, yeah. is that ridiculous. So it's just a handful of people have broken into it and broken. As a matter of fact, it's the same people that have broken into 10-7 that have pretty much run 10-6. You know what I mean? So... I, I, I will not underestimate it. Let me see some 10 sevens first. Let me see some solid 10 eights first before I start harp, harping at any potential 10 sixes from anybody else. But for now, I don't see them being a Shakiri quality um, when they get to the trials. Would the wind blow them down the track? Maybe. You know what I mean? But I'm not foreseeing that. Well, you know why me not jump to the conclusion there yet? Because you see, track tone, track tone always have surprises. surprises seeing and Shakiri me think I think she's gonna do some 200s leading up to 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 before she gets into championship probably a few hundred meters too but um you can't put nothing past track down. even though the, the, the is the 100 meter going to be that competitive on the female side as the men's side at the US trials you never know because you have some time people just show up that and that is US trials. So me I, I can't say, yo, no 10 6 now I run. People probably have to go in at the final, go run or semi final, you have to run fast for your, for your space. So kinda too early. More oh, so let's put few, it this way. If I see randomly start running 10 sixes, I don't want any American to take it the wrong way, but me I can start look so like what's going on because Bombastic side. Well, you may be able to look at a few talented people and say, Yeah, you can definitely see them getting into 10 6. Even Shakiri that has done that windy 10 10 5. If Shakiri gets it right on the right day with the right wind, she's gonna she's gonna fly. Right? No so land. for me, that's not really surprising. Hmm? World record. What world record? The man said huh? Chuck Tone, I will give Shakiri the world record. Probably. No, no probably. Remember, Shakira won a windy 10 5 7 there, you know. Mm -hmm. So, no windy, did it go still? <laughs> All right, that was a Shakira. That was a the year that she ran that windy 10 um, 5 7, 10 5 7, right? Mm. What was she running that year? And this is a this is no a Shakira that is a 10 6 athlete. All right, so and I agree with you, but not wild, you see, it's not wild. All right, this this might be taking it overboard for me. Seeing this might be taking it overboard, and on a, on a, on a can't take me on. But how many times has Shakira run um, that 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 um ten six? How many times do you One. need to run it? Well, I know that, that, that may, may I get to that you know. She run it one time. Sherry can run it one time. So when them going at the realm one time, we call them 10-6 athlete. Because for me, I think they would have to do it consistently. So if she go back there again, I can say, all right, Shakir is a 10-6. Sherry is a 10-6 athlete. Marking no, though, that they, they actually went there. 
I can't agree with you with that. And I'm going to tell you why. Two things. If you are presently running the time, then you are considered that athlete. Let's say, you know, a bunch of years pass, 10 years pass, then and you're, you're all you're doing is running 10 nines, 10 eights, then yeah. At a particular point, I'm no longer going to be considering you a 10, um, six athlete, right? But at the same time, are we trying to say that Elaine is not a 10 five sprinter? She did it once. I'm asking you if that's what you're saying. Based, based, upon, based upon my analogy, analogy, of course. The world record was only run once. How dare you blasphemous. That time. No, it's not black. No, I tell a teen, you know, so when I deal with when I look at things, I look different, you know. I mean, now I'm going to be biased upon a certain argument. You have to be consistent upon a certain thing. Most of these athletes are 10 7 runners. And I'm they, not they, being they, biased they, they when might, I say they that. They might get a good condition one time and boom, then gone over in a 10 6. I'm not really and defending that, Shakiri, I'm defending Ilian. And that happened, but you see, you're, you're not, you're not, you're not something there then. <laughs> you're, you're being biased. No, somebody <laughs> said in the comment section that I'm defending Shakiri, and I said, no, I'm defending Ilian. <laughs> so, for me, the consistency after that. Day. Um, Akeem Blake ran 9-8 how many times? Would, you, would we consider him a 9-8 sprinter? He might have to go back there for me so that. For me, if you're doing it within, again, if you're presently doing it, then for me, you are. If it's something from yesteryear, and I think I had this discussion with somebody on my channel about Carmelita Jetta, and I talked mm. about her running 10-6 in 2009, was it? Mm. Um, and then what type of athlete she would have been considered the, for most of her life and i said she wouldn't even have been considered a 10 7 athlete really because she only you know run run 10 7 a few times also so she ran the 10 6 a few times she ran the 10 7 a few times she lived consistently in 10 8 so i remember having that conversation but that was what she was well then again you know what but is she is she <laughs> running is she running more than is she running 10 6 more than one time you know i will not have you um <laughs> diminish that 10.54 I refuse. No, but but T, that's why I'm saying no. They gonna say something, and if you know what, take me on, no, take me on. But, but me, I look at it from a different perspective. For true, <laughs> me I say, if you if you don't run it consistently, would you be considered? Because that would that would have be a PB now. Your PB would have been a place that you have never been before. You only did it once. So if you if you're not constantly doing that, are going to your in, I in still a, in can't a agree with you, coach, PB. because even you saying both running ten point five eight, are you saying you say both is not ten? So so he, what does that run, even mean? That means he nothing. Nine, six, he run nine six multiple times. He ran it only twice. That still doesn't count as consistent. See? Of if he pass one. That's nonsense. Okay. <laughs> now you now we are moving the goalposts. All right. Nonsense. The nonsense. goalpost now move. <laughs> When Mr. T, it cannot be moving. I say you have to run it more than once to be no. considered. No, no, I no, no. You said three. consistency. I didn't say four. Running it twice cannot be considered consistency in no way, shape, or form. And worse, so many years apart, he ran it in 2008. The 9-6 was 2008, right? And then he came back in 2012 and ran 9-6. And you want to tell me that that was consistency? No. That, that that cannot count. So we can't move the goalposts. So, we so can't that move means you, you cannot so defend we're throwing out, we you have to go throw out all of them. You both them 10, you 5, can't. and 10, 6. We have to go throw out, you see, and both them 10, so, 5, and, fine. 9, 5 and, and, 9, 6, and 9, 6. And Carl, you see, and both a 9, 7 sprinter. Fine, if you want to. And if you check, if you, if you are going to use mathematics on average, of course, it's probably be right there. Blasphemous. <laughs> Drink some water. <laughs> <laughs> Numbers don't lie, though. Numbers cannot lie. <laughs> that, may I tell you. Numbers cannot lie. If you if you do want 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 average on calculation, I I, I say for example ten times, they want look for that. 
the average cannot go fight nine for um nine nine agreed five. agreed when it, agreed when you say that but again it cannot you cannot disregard the ten five the nine five because it wasn't done quote unquote consistently to say you're not a nine five sprinter you're you're going to be called no that's why I may say mature it out and I say all right we're not gonna take me on for this me no business you run it once so that is now your what your personal best seen so that is the fastest you have ever run but have and you ever the bar. gone there again have you ever gone there again no until you until you pass it that become your new personal best seen and so for example him run 958 and him run 957 and him run 952 and him run 955 right there and then you'd have him run in at the 95 bracket more than right, let me once, just put it this way based on twice, what you're saying coach twice, based on what you're twice. saying nobody sprinting right now is whatever they are so whatever their personal best is they're not that that's pretty much what you're saying no that's not pretty um, much what other I'm than Shelly Shelly and maybe Elaine you would say maybe in the 10 sixes right but look at look at let's look at the men the Christian Coleman so many times have they gone 10, 10 um, 9 7 twice maybe um Fred Curley maybe did it once um no allows how much times has he run um um nine eight a, a couple of times so uh -huh. what are we saying exactly i i don't know i don't think i can agree with this for me personally as long as you're doing it in um like when you're currently active and you're still performing up to standard for me a standard has a range so you're you're running between x and y Right, you're not just running X. You're running between X and Y, and as long as you're running between X and Y, you're still a consistent whatever performer you are. Right, but you don't have to be hitting ten five every time to be considered a ten five sprinter, or hitting ten six every time to be considered a ten six sprinter. As long as you're running consistently, like say for instance, Sharika and Shakiri have only gone ten six once, right? But they consistently run ten sevens, which means that they're still within the range of that ten six, right? So they're there still are, within. There, there are there are based on. Where you call it now, personal best, they would have run 9 6. But they are technically 10, um, 10 6 runners. Because they go there some well, more. 10 7. 10 7 rather, because they go there some more consistently. And again, as I'm saying, your performance for me is it has a range, right? So for a 10 6 sprinter, I'm expecting a 10 6 sprinter to be consistently running within a particular range. It doesn't box them into 10 6 no. alone. Uh, for me, no, that's, but, that's unfair to T, say a 10 6 T. sprinter has to only be running 10 6s no. or consistently always no. be running 10 6s. As no, long as you you're in the range no, of the 10 6s, you can't use and range. Is within, no, you cannot low, use range. T, you cannot use seven. range. You cannot right, use then. range. There's yeah, no way you can I use may range. Disagree. You can't, may even disagree. if you disagree with me, you cannot use range for say because you run a range in the say you're ten six runner. That's that, that foolish is that. Me, me can't that agree. Fool. Me know what me have to say to make sure I said that ten five, that nine five eight holes. If a, if a range that, of um, T, and, and if you ever use range, holes. listen. Me not discredit them personal best. I want the people them understand me. Credit is given to their personal best. See? But you cannot say because you run 10.65 and you run 10.70, um, 10.71, 10.72 because you're in the range, you're going to be a 10.6 runner. No, T, I can't agree with that. No, no way, shape, or form. Let me ask you a question. There's no I range have to ask you a question. That. No, no, no. Look at this. Um, let me let me see, see see if this makes sense to you, right? So an athlete is running ten point six five. Follow me, right? Mm -hmm. And they're running ten point seven one, ten point seven two, ten point seven three. Let's just say um mm -hmm. that's what they're running. What is the difference between that same athlete running ten seven zero and ten seven nine? Isn't that a wider gap? That is a wider gap. But yet you call that person consistent ten seven, yeah? So what is wrong with saying that the person who is running 10-6, as long as they're close enough, they're still that person? But they're not in... It, T, people drop out of a race because of 0 0.01. So because the people they go, go close to that, they put them in, a, in, a, in a the semi-final or the final. No, so you cannot use that as a range. What, what are we saying? We can't... Con no, that's not, that's not um, conf convolute the, the conversation with, with other stuff that will make me probably get confused. When it comes to a range right so you're saying 1070 to 1079 is considered 107 correct 
10 what? And that's a consistent. No, I didn't 10, hear what 7, you said. 0. Okay, 1070 to 1079 is considered a consistent 107 sprinter regardless if you're running if you've run one 10 10 7, 0, and every other race you've run is a 10 7, 9, you're considered a 10 7 sprinter right that's mm -hmm. what you're saying mm -hmm. so every other race you've run is a 10 7, 9 versus that 10 7, 0. and how many hundreds of a second is between 10 10 7, 0 and 10 7, 9 versus if you're running a 1 10 6, 5 and you have that 10 7 1 10 72 what is what is what, what? see all mix up yourself with you you hear me now no i'm not if mixing you, up myself i'm if asking you're you. running well, I know. If you're how, can, 10, how can an athlete that is running 1065, 1071, 1072 be considered less consistent than an athlete that runs 11070 and multiple 1079s? I'm just asking you, how can it be considered less consistent? Uh, based off what I heard you said, the athletes run 1065, 1070 up to 1079. So that person would have run 1070 at a one. 7 1 go right up to 9. So that person would have run 9 times in the 7 10. No, seven that's bracket. not what I said. That's not what I said. I said he's run okay. that, that one time 10 7 0. One mm -hmm. time 10 7 0. Mm -hmm. And then the other performances are 10 7 9. There's no 10 7 8. There's no 10 7 6. There's no nothing else. Just 10 mm -hmm. 7 0. That one 10 7 0. And then mm -hmm. everything else is 10 7 9. And I'm saying, how can that person? Be considered more consistent than the person that is running one ten six five and has a bunch of ten seven ones, ten seven twos. Well, I'm not to get where you are, that, 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 If a person run ten seven zero and ten seven nine, that person would be considered to, to, from my look, argument look, at ten seven. I'm not letting go me ten point five four. Now I'm nine point five eight. No, but I'm not letting it go. Me just a try flip. Um, look, look at it from a different perspective. The person would have only go, all right. If we are use bracket now, t, ten seven bracket, ten six bracket, ten eight bracket, ten nine bracket. The the the, the, the bracket where you're running in are the most. No, it must be considered you as that type of athlete because you would have run more in that range than. That's not that, 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 I, get, that I get that you're looking at it in brackets, but you're looking at it in brackets in, in terms of that kind of whole number between so that, 10, 7 and, and, that and 10, point. 7, 9. That, but I'm not looking at it from a 10, 7 and 10, 7. Why can't it be 10, 6, 5 and 10, 7, 9? What, um, why can't it be 10, 6, 5, sorry, and 10, 7, 5? Why can't that be the bracket? Why does it have to be 10, 7, 0 well, and it, 10, it, 7, 9? It, it can be bracket. Because 10, once you, go, once you pass that, you're gone over in a 6. So, oh, you're going to use 7 and 6 for baby range. I you, find you it over implausible. I find it implausible to think that a sport as, as it relates to track and field that comes mm. down to times and, and so many different variables, whether it's the wind affecting you, whatever the case is. And because you're unable to hit that same 10.58, mm -hmm. I mean, 10.454, sorry, or, uh, or 9.58 consistently over and over again because of whatever variables may be affecting. And I'm not talking about injuries. Forget injuries and everything else. You're perfect and you turn up. There are so many different variables that can affect your performance on any given day and you're going to tell me that because you are not consistently hitting 10-5 over and over again or 9-5 over and over again and you're not considered an, uh, a 9-5 sprinter or a 10-5 sprinter I just can't I can't I can't get with that but the variables that are there are a part of the cha uh, uh, are a part of the competition are a part of track and field so you have to work with no, but the your variables. variables the variables directly affect your performance exactly so you so right if it affects your performance why you gonna no. want to stretch why are you going to want to stretch me running 1065 1071 772 and say me I'm a, because of that range I'm a 106 runner Okay no, let's just say I'm the most unfortunate that. person in the world let's just say I'm the most unfortunate person in the world and every time I touch the track I get a negative 5.0 meters per second win and one time and one time I get one win that was a, a, a 1.0 or maybe a 0 0.5 I was able to run a, a 10.7 but otherwise than that because I'm mm -hmm. always getting negative fives unfortunately my times live in the 10.9s am Unfortun I a 10 un Unfortunately you're a 10.9 sprinter 
get the condition. Go to Kenya, go run. Go to some place, okay, go I run, can. so you can't consistently I, run. I can't part. rock with that. I can't well, rock me, with that. Me can't rock with the ass of the range either. So we, we are going to rock apart. <laughs> We are going to rock apart because people, the, 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 the variables of the conditions, the wind, execution is also a part of it. Should No, that's on you. Execution is on you. I mean, variables it, that you can't is, control. It is, it no, is till, that is, is you. You can't control of, that. But you, you, will, you will not run consistently executing the perfect race every time you run. So it is a okay, part of it. So you you just said that you will not run consistently executing the race, but yet you expect miraculously that these these athletes are always going to be consistently hitting their PB over and over and over again. Yes, but you, uh, well, Anna, you mentioned the wind reading. So if, all right, if me get wind reading 1.2 every time me run, I me are running at 10.6. What am I going to be called? Uh, every time I get higher than that, me gone in a, in a, in a 10, 10, 8, 10, 9. What am I going to be called? A consistent 10 6 runner. Don't tell me the foolishness. Okay. I, I can't rock with it. We just have to go rock apart for that, for that fight. Yeah. And, and that's why I say we have to rock apart. <laughs> because you look on the one way, so the, 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 the condition is going to help the athlete or it's not going to help the athlete. But what if it helps the athlete every time the athlete performs to run 10.5? So why do we the say. Help the athlete let me ask to you a question then. Why do we say. Because Jamaicans are doing it a lot, and I think you yourself have, has, has said it as well. Mm. But why do we say if Sherika had gotten better conditions, she'd have broken the world record? Why would not just hold the, the, the 21.4 one and go sit down? Because she, why, are we still, calling, why are we calling Sherika world record holder? Why? Who, who, who said who said that? Who said that? No, me never said she had a world record holder. No, 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 no. Why are we calling Can... Elaine world record holder then? Why are we doing these things then? Because, because, one place. Listen, Sherika herself said, You know the world record holder. Don't ask me no foolishness. Sherika said that at the the the, 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 the Olympics. See? I run with the reporter. Listen to me. If you we say Sherika now get the good condition for run the world record, it no matter. She never run the world record. So she's what? A 21 forerunner? She's not no world record holder. No, but look here. If Sherika what is a 21 forerunner. Let me just tell you something, it, Coach. When if she what get you're the, saying held when valid, she get the condition, there will be no calculator. Well, hold on. There will be no wind calculator. There will be mm. no us sitting down and calculating performances each time an athlete runs. When they're running a negative wind or a positive mm. wind, wouldn't on saying okay if we adjust it it would be blah 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 in that particular range we may not have the exact figure but we can have a range a ballpark it to say okay if the athlete ran in a in a in a in a in a wind that was allowable or whatever made them run perform well then guess what they would have run into this little range or this little, this little section if that wasn't the case we wouldn't use it we wouldn't be using it then we don't just make everything stay dry so so, so and move on with our life but T, did we say that the, the, the wind reading is a part of the uh, one of the variables that helped the athlete? Didn't we say that? No, I said it's a variable. And I right. said because it's a variable, mm -hmm. because conditions are a variable, how can we expect athletes to consistently hit the same mark when you don't know what conditions you're going to be get? And I'm not talking about the things you can control. You can control your execution. But I'm it's saying, not about execution. But that's looking, on you. But no, things but you are looking at T, you're looking at it from a, from a negative standpoint. And you should look at it from both angles. All right, you don't get the conditions to help you, but you get the con. And next athlete get the conditions to help them. What are you going to say? Them lucky. I'm me unlucky. Stop your foolish tea. <laughs> me not say you're better than me because if me and you line up together, we may see something different. You understand what I'm trying to say? Let's look at Shelly and Fraser Price. How many years have we talked about Shelly and, and her, unfortunately, always running these 1060s into some, some unfavorable conditions? And if she had gotten a better condi condition, she would have already run into 10.5s. What are mm. we saying exactly? But she's still not a 10.5 runner. We are saying I'm not that saying she's a 10.5 runner, but I'm saying we wouldn't be exactly, considering these things if exactly it didn't matter. You want to hear what she said? She's not saying she's a 10.5 runner. 
So she threw away her range and she said did that she said. It was a 10-5 runner. No, no, no. We were talking about Elaine. You said that if you run it once, you cannot be considered a 10-5 runner. I was talking about Elaine and, and, and um, you saying, and I said that cannot be fair because you have to look at the range. That is what no, I said. But I'm so saying, if you're consistently running no, within the range of T, this person, what is wrong you know, with saying T. that you are? I am saying, and people no, mis mis misinterpret what I said to. I am saying their personal best is their personal best. I don't show it away. I am looking at it from a different standpoint. So even if we are, uh, there's a probability that if Shelly get that um, wind reading, or if Sherika get that wind reading, or if Elaine had gotten a good read in wind reading, that is probability. If they had gotten that, they could have run such and such a time. They did not get it. So because they consistently not getting that part, which is a part of the whole variable and the grand scheme of thing for you to run particular away, whether you get negative or positive, it help you positively or negatively. You understand? So if Sherika get consistently not the, 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 the wind reading that she the, she not get the wind reading where she want, based off probability and calculation, she will never run the world record. So because that is happening, Sherika is a 21 4 runner. And I, that may so say, because of conditions, we have to throw out any performances that could have been. But even when you get it, you still have to throw it out because at one time you do it. Moving on, next conversation. I am saying their personal best cannot be taken away. I am just I saying. Disagree. I am just saying. If you do it once, would I, I want question? May I ask you know? And we are try. Uh, we are try. We are try debate it you know. May I ask the question? Would it be considered an athlete being a ten five runner if the athlete consistently are run more ten six times than the ten five? Would it be considered the athlete being if a an athlete has runner? run ten five? right and he's mm -hmm. consistently running close to that 10 5 personal best or whatever that personal best is i don't care whether it be let's say for instance your your personal best is 10.8 something and you're consistently within the range of what it is then yes i am considering you that but if you're running 10 5 and then you start living in 11.30 seconds then i'm gonna maybe start looking at so, your word so who determined that range why did you put that range in i mean who determined that range isn't that how you rate performances? To say what's good and what is not good? No, yes, a range. What, what is your range? What is your range? It's particular to each athlete and their performance. So, it, say, for instance, Elaine and Shelly is two different athletes and the range as it relates to their performances is different for both. I will not look at Shelly and expect what I expect from Elaine or vice versa. I'm looking at them individually and I'm like, okay, let see, me see what you can give me. You're not the question, you know. I said, what is the range? I don't range? know what to say then. I want to know what is your range. What would you keep them to be in the same range? I just that may ask you, you know. So if 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 an athlete run ten five five, or not ten, all right. Say the athlete run ten five nine, and they run ten, ten, ten six two, ten six three, ten six four. Are you gonna say that range will keep them as a ten five runner? That may ask of you course. know. How comes? How? How? You're trying to tell me that. All right. The people are asking for next um, comments. I said, yes, it will keep you as a 10.5 sprinter. If an athlete has run 10.59, they have 10.60, um, 10.61, um, whatever the case is, that still keeps you as a 10.59 a 10 athlete, in my opinion. But it is what it is. Let's move so, on. So, hold on. So, if an athlete, so if a, a, the world record is 10.49 and the athlete run 10.50 and 10.51, the athlete is a, is a world record holder? What? According to range, I mean, I hear you. If the world record old older run ten point four nine, seeing, mm -hmm. and a next athlete come and run ten point five zero, and run ten point five one, and run ten point five three. Because of that close no, no, no. proximity what in terms of range. Me, no, no, and no, well, no, no, man, no, 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 no,
What? It's based off what you it, it can be two different things. You say if you got 10.5 and you run 10 point this, it are gonna be in the same that range. Is so you're not what this. I am saying. So make we use world record. If no. an athlete, no, 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 no. Remember, the athlete has already run it. They have already run it, but you want to disregard it by saying it because they've only done it once. And I said that cannot be fair because if they're I am not disregarding it. it, I am they, not disregarding it. Yes, you are. Not, you say no. they're not that athlete. I am. <laughs> Then you're gonna say to me now that well, then if somebody runs 10.50, then can that be considered 10.49? But after them never run the 10.49, we're talking about the person T, that actually run the 10.49. T, T, you run 10. Point f um 10.50, and the next set of races then where you run, you're in the 10.6 bracket. Are you considered a 10.5 runner, barring? That you'd have gone there once. Would you consider that at least a 10.5 or a 10.6? I don't care how many times it... you've gone that time, right? For me, you are that athlete. The only way now I would start to say, are you still in the shape to run that? So now we're starting to talk about if you're still within the shape to run that time. Is if years have passed between, say for instance, you've run that, like how people love to bring up the Elaine now and say she's run that 10.54 from 2000 and, um, was it 2001? So she's not in that shape to currently be considered that athlete. Then we can have that conversation. If so many years have passed and you're living into 10, 9, 11 seconds and you're nowhere close. But if you're consistently running 10, 6s and you have that one 10, 5, then how can you be saying that the person is not? I don't know. P K L, all that for be disrespect. I am asking a question. You see... You see, people will just come on for the live tea, and you know, so you make them a think that though, because you are, you are convolute the conversation and a stick out for the 10.5 because but alien, you alien, keep alien. The question, I told you to let's move on how long now? No, what you mean me? because the people then come on and think, say, me, I disregard them, and I say, disrespect me, I disregard the person and uh, them. Tell the people, them say, me make that point there already. I say, me now look, me now overlook, but me I ask a question. Are you make the people ever think so? Listen, <laughs> yeah, because yeah, yeah, my alien. understanding of track and field is clearly different. When my, when I come to my, let, let me just leave it. This is the last point I will make, and let's move on to the next topic because we've been on this for a while, coach. So this is the last point I will make. Whilst you will look at flat figures in um in track and field and say yes, that is the personal 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 best, and I can agree with that statement, right? However, for me, not because you're not hitting that personal best every time you run means you're not a consistent performer for me as long as you're in a close enough range of that performance you are still that quality pro athlete that you are you understand what i'm trying to say as long as you're within a range so that's the that's how i look at it and I, and, and let's leave it there I mean, i'm not going to say you know an athlete that has run 10-5 one time or let's just use it let's not use just um elaine because so many years have passed so we can have the discussion whether or not she's still a 10.54 athlete at this particular moment but even you saying both at the highest of his powers right prowess was still consistently close enough to what he had done before so my opinion is we can't disregard those those times and say oh they weren't good enough because he wasn't hitting um nine five every single time no i i can't agree with that but um yeah that's just how i look at it so Make your last point, sir. Let's go on to the ten seventy seven. Yeah, may I make my last point? You know, you know, you know why I ask a question there? Because the world and people outside of United States tend to disregard the world record of ten point four nine. Because of That's the That's not why they do it. Lord God, you see? Tina, behave ourselves for the people. Me, me me can't, me, I'm muting, I'm muting. Can, I'm muted. Can't, I, can't I give my closing statement on, on as to why I ask the question? Eh? Jesus, peace. Mm -mm. What may I say? Me ask the question, seeing? Because the world record was run once. Irrespective of the highlights around that world record. Seeing people disregard it because of what is around it. Seeing, but can you consider the person still a world record holder? Yes, it stands. And it is supporting my point that you can run your PB 
and you're good enough to run that PB, but it, are you that type of runner to consistently run 10 4, 10 4, 10 4? Which oh, will I can't let this one record. slide. Anyways, people, so apologize. let us talk about the 800 meters that ran today. That was done today. Navaski was beaten. Watch the mouth. I try to open the talk. <laughs> if T say anything upon this, it's sure I got counting upon this. Honestly. <laughs> <laughs> because she, she give me her closing point and me give me closing point. I and just she... can't give such a closing point. You but closing I point didn't tell you. you what we I d <laughs> but you can't tell me why me you ask the question. No, Joe. First and foremost, her time being disregarded has absolutely nothing to do with the fact that she's run 10.491. once. It has nothing to do with that. People are saying that they're wondering if she had. So you can't tell me why me ask the question. Why they want to disregard it? But no, no, no. Let me finish. <laughs> but if we should go back to the year one, people say that that was one of the best years ever because of how many times she was running super fast. So I don't really follow. But she not so run the 10 four at one time. She run the 10 four. And, okay. and and that's why I'm um, asked the question. Cause while it ended with that flow, Jordan. I don't mean, know why me rally me rally back in. Come, come, make we, make we move. <laughs> you know, spoil, me I give you the, the genesis of me asking the question. <laughs> flow Joe run it one time. Is she considered a 10 4 runner? That's how I ask the question. Um be a she is. Right she is. It's disregarded for a complete different reason. It's not it has nothing to do with consistency. Anyways, that 800 meters, that 800 meters that was done today, what do you think about it? I did a video on it and I have it coming out in the morning. I, I cried. I was so happy. I couldn't believe when I saw that home stretch and I looked and I saw Jamaica, 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 Jamaica. I was like, We've got, we're getting there. We are getting there. Oh, my God. I was just so happy. Over with emotions um yeah we're clearly not there 100 percent, but it's a sign for the future um and yeah all i just have is um great expectations for jamaica's depth i keep talking about it in our um in my lives i keep saying that you know i feel like jamaica is gradually getting deeper and deeper where we will get to the point where we'll be eventually able to field um you know, three athletes in each event. You know what I mean? And slowly but surely you can see, and I mean three world-class athletes. I don't just mean just picking up numbers. You know what I mean? And slowly but surely I see us kicking down the doors. It started with Navaski doing his thing. And I don't know, like, especially when I look at a Tyrese Roden this year, the energy I'm getting from Tyrese Roden, Tyrese Roden is a different energy me I get from Tyrese Roden, right? Kimara Farkison as well, coming to Texas A&M and doing his thing. Absolutely fantastic. And also Tyrese Reed is there, but that's not the only Jamaican. Remember my guy there that ran one, the indoors, isn't even in this list. You understand what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. Flabbergasted by how great we're becoming over the over the 800 meters. I was like, what? A Jamaica is a guanza? It's, it's, it's good things to come. It's good things to come for me. And and it it, it it goes to show that at trials it's it's gonna be one of the races to talk about. Yes. And normally the blue ribbon event, which would have been the one hundred meters, uh, and then you might look at the hurdles, the two hundred, the four hundred, the four hurdles, and, and some of the, the, the field events. But it, it's really a joy to see these athletes who are, you know, entering the fray putting in the work because they are hungry you understand and they want to be a part of 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 this thrust this 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 legacy so to speak that we are creating in the 800 meters and and it would have basically uh kickstart by 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 Navaski. you understand and what he did last year was 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 even special because the last day of the, the qualification the man get the, the time so I, I just yeah. hope though that they can get down to that qualifying standard so that they can, you know, qualify and, and not only do well on these circuits, but go out there and actually um represent the country at the Olympics. You understand? So that is what I want to see. Uh somebody mentioned that yes, Rivaldo Marshall wasn't in this one. 
You understand? Rivaldo Marshall is one of them that and and Farkas. He won the indoors, a, indoors eight hundred. Yeah. So Farkasin is a Calabar man. Navaski is a Saint Diego man. Tyrese Road. Now which school him used to go again? I uh, want school on a country there, no. Um, where school the name again? Roads. Uh, uh, Roads something like that. I don't remember it name. And and Tyrese Reed was was the next youth from from down the country too. So it's good to see that these athletes would have continued on 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 their on their thing. Rivaldo Marshall would have been a part of it, but he did not show up. He did not start. Um, he's from Iowa. So listen. I like what I see in this 800 meters. I don't cry like T still. You understand? Because she's on the side. I don't depend on the ball inside. Whereas uh, the men them are run. If they do females, they know that they on a different thing. It's <laughs> so great when I look at how we've grown. We've grown so much. Just think about it. Just, uh, just pause a second. Just think mm -hmm. about, just in general, over the past two years, We've really grown so much in the field events, in, in more events. Like the team that we're sending this time around will be so, you know, rounded. And I'm, I'm just excited for it. I don't, um, this has clearly never happened, but I'm just saying like, look at the drums, look at the long jump, look at the, um, look at the long jump, look at the triple jump. And I'm talking both men and women, right? Mm -hmm. That Jamaica is doing it. Um, Again, we're slowly but surely opening doors in other areas. May not be as strong, you know, to necessarily medal, but still it's, it, it's a start. And I'm like, wow, if you told me that this would be happening two years ago, I don't think I would believe you, especially with what I'm seeing in the long jump. Men's long jump, Jamaica, I, I hold down two medal, almost three medal. You know what I mean? The same set of guys are coming back this year again to do 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 even further damage. Like we look at the triple jump. Um, I'm like, what is going on with Jamaica? It's it's great things. It's definitely great things. Um, for me, and I've been echoing this for a few years now from from the Frederick Dakers um time that we are slowly becoming a track and field nation ra rather than just a, a, a track nation. Track. Mm -hmm. So we, we we surpass the track now. We we are do so much exploits on the track that we start to go in at the in at the middle of the park which is the field and we, we, we are do well in a discuss. We are do well in a in a the in a the um the 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 the, the, the shot and then we want to see it extend now to the javelin. We have some purses knocking on the javelin door. Um, but it, it, it seems to be eluding us where, where that is concerned. But I, I, uh, Elvis Graham is one of them that is knocking on the javelin door. Um, but definitely, I think, and, and you see, we, we, we have to be, what you'd call it now, very mindful of, of, of how we speak now no? because when we look at athletes taking that trip overseas these are the benefits that we are reaping and it might not be all but we are reaping the benefit in the field we have a Julian Robinson doing wonders with the throws in Jamaica kudos to him you understand big up to um coach Julian Robinson for, for doing a, a, a th I think he basically kicked the start the whole thing, you know, you understand, in, in, in Jamaica. But some of the athletes would have matriculated to the NCAs and all of these. They are the ones who are pulling it for the jumps and the, and, and the throws and now by extension the 800 meters. So sometimes when the athletes make a decision to go, we are wondering, hey, they're going to burn out, hey, they're going to this, they're going to that. Come on. Every decision they make, whether it is good or bad or if you're out good or bad, it is a decision that they decided to make with, with I guess, with counsel, of course. Yeah? So, sometimes we have to just share them on. Um, they are still not where we'd want them to be because, again, like I said, the, the qualifying standard has to be met. But I, I, I do believe that they, they, they are close to that... Um, um qualifying in terms of probably about a few few seconds off but with hard work and dedication definitely 
I do believe that they, they, they can get there. You understand? Definitely. But we are, we are moving from beyond a uh, track nation where we exploit the track to being a track and field nation. And that is good. Uh, we have to just ensure that decisions from the uh, lower end or the administrative end, end will help or continue to push. Even though the administration... Listen, let me tell you about something about the administration. I know. A long time I want to touch a topic or two, you know. You know, say, based off what Jamaica is doing and the exploits that it is doing, it basically uh, cover the wound of what the administration is not doing. And that really are going, you know. And the exploits, so we are going with make you see, it look like um, J3 are one of the best run ad administration, you know. It is far from the truth. You understand? It is far from the truth. But... I hope that they will not just be comfortable with our exploit, with our dominance. But they will put things in place, especially for the junior athletes, so that they can be nurtured, so that they can be taken care of going forward. Uh, you know, decisions can be uh, made that are to their best interest. You know, even though sometimes the fans them now go like some of the decisions with them make. But... It is always in their best interest. You see, Master? Yeah, man. Yeah, Nolan Miller, we know that, man. But, I true, I true, I know, I know, what the athletes are doing is basically over shadowing what the administration is not doing. So, we're not too pre them. <laughs> you understand? Mm -hmm. um, Coach, I wanted to ask you something. Are you having an issue with YouTube? Yeah, man, YouTube are going on some foolish. Like you can't toggle some of the switches and stuff? Yeah. Oh, because I thought it was just me. Because um, I was like, what is happening? When we did see it happen there, them now send out your notification. When you no, not that. Studio. I mean, in YouTube studio. When you ask, well, no, I don't have no problem in our studio. But when I like set stream oh. and them something, they either jump off, go up on one time where you not set it on. Uh, some look up some look up things are going. I don't know what it is. No, I just I've been having um like I like my YouTube, I can't toggle anything in it. Like I have to be using my phone to toggle um my studio. And at this particular point I'm even wondering if it's my device because I don't even know what the hell is going on. Um is do you do you just shut down the lid of your 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 your, your laptop? My I'm computer not... never goes to sleep. You shut it down. It never goes to sleep. Okay. Meaning it's it's up running twenty four seven. <laughs> oh, cause when you say yeah. it never go to sleep, it would have sound like you would have shut it down. No, as in shut I don't shut it down. No, nothing. I just leave it up. I ain't got time to reopen nothing. <laughs> well, probably that's the problem. Like when I have to up do updates, then yes, I will shut it down uh, or restart. Let's put it that way. But okay. Um. Yeah. I'm not trying to baby it or anything, you know what I mean? But I just noticed recently that I've been having issues, so I was just wondering if it was a thing. Mm, probably, well, different people probably be having different challenges. Um, one I probably just need to reboot. Yeah. One of the next things we want to talk about is that 4 by 100 meters, when we see the US, them are do around the place. You know, so Jamaica is in trouble, though. I I I I I refuse to comment. I'm sorry. I can't comment. I have a video coming out on it, so I can't comment. We're in a trouble, people. Fabian, what go on? We're in a trouble with this four. I have a video coming out on it, so I can't comment. When me see the US are put, um, look for all Abistana. We just come back. Me see she blew a doggy back stretch, you know. She did. Yeah. So it looked like they are putting different teams together and see how the chemistry are going and they might go to the science class to ensure say, everything is in order. But look like we just look like we just a joke, man. And 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 why you know so we have a different mentality though. It's it is because of 
our competitive we, we nature been, we been individually, who? Jamaicans. It is because of our competitive nature individually. You mean our administrations? They all run the same way. Yeah, but when you look upon it too, sometimes them call something and some at least they not show up. I don't because, care. USA does not care. USA does camps. not care. They demand and what they demand and if you don't come, then to lose to you. The only ones that they really may give face sometimes are like the big, big ones. Like if, you have, if you're like a Nike person, then they may give you a favor and be like, oh, let me give you a blight. But really and truly, they don't care. They tell you to turn up. If you don't turn up, well, bye bye for you. There's somebody else to fill your spot. And I believe that that's what Jamaica needs to start doing. I don't care who it is. If you don't want to turn up, then bye bye to you because there's no way we can have 10 six athletes and we can't break world record all. No, we still can't even string together the correct four in the correct order. That not make no kind of sense. I uh, coach me, you know why you come stop me upon a relay, you know. But tell us, I mean, now comment and you come stop me. <laughs> no, but are you not for comment? Me have to talk about it because guess what? Me think that we're not trouble. And as I was saying, I think the competitiveness what we have individually is affecting our competitiveness as a team what am i saying we prefer to secure with, with individual bag and spend more time on that no than practice we have a bunch of the, leaders for, that for cannot group, lead for the group but if 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 the bunch of leaders now lead if it not start from day one you can't come at day four and that is why I said we have a bunch right of leaders that cannot lead. You need leaders to lead. If you cannot lead, then everybody's going to do whatever they want to do, which is what you see happening now. Every camp in Jamaica is doing whatever they want to do, and that is that. They turn up when it's time to run at the Olympic Games, and we, we get on a leg, and that is it. Everybody's allowed and, to do whatever they do because we have nobody leading. And that's why I say individually. We want to do things. We want to do the exploits individually. But we come together. We don't want to do it. And yes, it starts with the leaders. Them not. And because everybody and everybody are friends, that mash up the thing too. Everybody and Why everybody coach? are friends. Me and this are really, uh, I have a love-hate relationship going on right now. I best believe me. <laughs> do you think them are going on with we have a love hate relationship thing. going on right now. Did you talk about the 1077 already? Did we talk about it? No. We Are you talked about it? it? Well, uh. we mentioned it in our video, but we, uh, we talk about it when we just start, but we never get into the details. We just mentioned it, say, somebody to have a talk about. But the really thing they need to start it out, J Trace, we don't know if you not listen, somebody we are listening and them are friends, we're going to tell them what we are about the relay. US are run really, I'm sure them, say, we just them a, we lead. just a, we just are gonna pick up a, a team, team and send and send ga something there. And, 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 and send ga, ga pen relays and then which other relay we are gonna go. We now probably go another relay and then world relays. Let me ask you a question. Which team are they sending team. to the world relays? T which team? No team are send? Which team are they sending to the pen relays? At the end I of the day. Know. They, 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 we're rotting from head down. There is no way you can just strew to, strewn together. Let's just say a C team, D team for Jamaica to go run at pen relays, go run at um rural relays, right? And then replace them as soon as we get to the Olympics because they are not good enough. But they're the ones that you had practicing. What kind of example is that setting? We're not using them for anything else. Any, we're not using them for when it matters most. So what's the point of this going to pen release? Going to pen release is, if for Jamaica is nonsense because we're not doing what we're supposed to do. Right now, just like how USA have USA red, blue, whatever else, color white, we need to have Jamaica black, green, or gold. I saw Jamaica deep in at the 100 meters. For the life of me, why we can't have Jamaica black, green, and gold? I don't know. And and as Errol McIntosh said, the, and, and, and that's why I say the individual thing that caused this. Because when, I, when, 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 when the people them link up and say, all right, we have put out invitation for it. Oh, I am not available. Oh, I am not available. Oh, I am not available. Then, a then as it's simple, coach. It's simple. If we're going to lose anyway, it doesn't matter how far we lose. Silver is silver, right? So if we're going to lose to America, to the loo to you, 
and let's use another four. There are so many fast girls waiting in the wings right now that are dying to run on a relay. I'm sure Kevona would love to run. I'm sure Brianna Liston would love to run. I'm sure there's so many people that would love to run and they would still walk in and give us a silver medal. So this is how I'm looking at it, right? If a silver we're gonna get anyway, then two do to all of these big guns. If one don't want to be there, then buy to all of you. You understand what I'm trying to say? America used a team that consisted of no big names and walked us in 2022. Walked us and left us there and we lost. Why we can't do the same? Let us pick up some girls that are interested in running and have them, you know, practice together and send them. I don't care about no big names. Go sit down someplace. You're not serving your purpose. Yep, yeah, Beyonce. We see, we see that man. Two sub forty one. Two sub forty two, sir. Them them run to the two separate teams US use. A and B um blue and red team. A and B same way. And you know you never have Shakira, you never have Gabby, you never have TT. But why are those purses not available? I think are the same thing. No, 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 no. Stop right there. Stop right there. It's not that they're not available. I listened to, and it's a, I don't know if a God made me listen to that particular race there and the particular commentary. What they said is that this is America's um, relay camp. So they have relays going across at all of these games. You don't have to go to all of them. You don't have to go to all of them. They're making it sure that all of these athletes can turn up at the events and be a part of the relays, and they'll be able to see who will be able to really run a proper four by four, four by one for them when when it comes to obviously the Olympic Games. So all of these different games. The week before, when was it? The week with the Texas relays and Florida relays and so so Shakira yeah, never yeah, run this yeah, run. But I, it wasn't Shakira, for did US they run team. This run? Yeah, but I never for US team. But yeah, um, Gabby did run too. Yeah, man. It doesn't matter. You, so they're, it consistent, doesn't matter. they're consistently in, in, in relay um, shape. Because That's the whole point. Meet, so the, so yeah. USA will be having all of these relays going across the country every single time there's a meeting and the athletes will just be partaking. It doesn't matter if it's a USA red, blue or green or whatever and you want to do it by your club. None of that matters. The point is you're partaking in the relays. That's the um, whole point. You're sharpening your skills. No, no land. the camp is not basically a go in our one camp and you're practicing enough. So for example, to based on how we see it is like they, they, they select different meets to have teams showing up. Or if these persons are registered for the for the meet, or if they are not, they should be at this meet so they can run a four by four. So whatever is happening, they might do them warm up, they might practice, they might get in them runs and all of them things there. Are they getting paid? I am not sure. If they are getting paid, that is good. If Jamaica do it, of course the athletes are get paid you know, because the they might represent thing, the country. They might get per You know, the greatest thing coming out of this coach is what mm -hmm. America has, has been able to see in just these short few weeks of running relays. There's so many athletes that have come out really short. Look at, um, what's his name over the 200 meters? Look at a young guy. Oh, Jack, what's um, his name? Knighton. Knighton. Nobody was ever considering Knighton for a relay. And look there now. So this is why you need to have these things set up. Look how much, look how much different, um, look how much different development meter keeper Jamaica. You may be tell me say MVP with them big old club can't string together two teams go run. You may be tell me say elite can't do the same. Oh please. I'm over it. I'm over them and all of these people that are, oh, I'm too good to go run. Or whatever it is. Who who knows? I don't Op really know what it is, but I'm over it. Opinion, which would we know say we know say that I uh, 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 we oh we look upon it you know oh because we are got through champs and we are got through this some not do it for years brother after they leave champs I me used to remember me used to have, have a thing where you take MVP swept track club them used to run a mile of relays and them something we don't see people not even them something that them are run again Gibson relay you see few teams run out well we see racers run out and some other teams. But you we tell you which club the, I've the, seen. The, 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 the people there. Maurice. Maurice when they need club. To run out, run out. What's Maurice's club name again? There. I keep forgetting. Sprint Tech. Sprint Tech. Sprint, I've seen Sprint Tech take the effort because I've watched them during the season, especially during the junior season, and they've been running relays. Right? I'm looking and I'm like, so where everybody else there? Even if you don't want to run against your competition, you can't tell me, say, 
MVP can MVP can full up MVP can full up eight lane by themselves with athletes just to get some relay practice in. But let me tell you one thing, coach. One thing I will not be taking as an excuse this year is who can run what leg because they can't pass button. I do not care. Well, that is a reality in 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 relay. And a years me a coach and me see that happen. So me not go say like you. It is, it is, it is, it is what it is. It's not what yeah. it is. And I think because we no, have this mentality have of some, it is what it is, though, why it's not changing. Um, T is not mentality. Uh, experience, me I talk of. Uh, experience. We got meet, and the athlete, what we say, can't, can't, uh, we're going to try, and we mix it up, and it feel. I mean, I talk about when we, when, when we do. When we go back in Excuse next week, me. I, I, Who I said every, anything was going to work at the same time? That's why you keep doing it over and over again till it works. Uh, nobody's saying that go out there one time and do it, coach. Well, I uh, know, but you, me not finish talk. Me not finish talk, you know. We make A team, B team, C team, and we mix up the teams them each time. And it's the same people. We are changing pan leg. They're not making one. Put them back on first leg or anchor, and that is it. They can only touch the button once. You have, and it is a reality from primary, right. high school, college, and national team. Some people cannot touch the button twice. You're going to have a problem. Look what we happen up, uh, 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 something there. Um, character. Then put him on pan third leg. He man a turn around like a, a because I went run. And he used to four by four. So in turn up like him I go take the button in a four by four. It happens. You might have a different um, view, but me I tell you based on my, my experience. You can't use this is this is this is what I don't like that, that people love to use. They, they love to use this one half situation and use it as a base. What happened at Carifta? What happens at Carifta? Um, coach cannot be used as any type of example because one, like you rightly said, this is a four hundred meter athlete that is used to running four by fours. So rightly so, he has no idea what to do when he gets onto a four by one. You understand what I'm trying to say? We are talking about a set of athletes. See, that yeah, say me I use one half situation when me explain to you what I have done over the years with teams that I have coached. Me can't talk about nobody else, you know. You disregard everything when me say I'm going to your character um, example I'm using. No? Coach. <laughs> you disregard Coach. every other thing when me say. And use the listen. character example. Listen, this is exactly why Jamaica is failing. Coach, Coach's Dex is why Jamaica is failing. Well, as 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 Jeff said, I'm a friend them. On his mindset is why Jamaica Je is failing. Jeff said, I'm a friend them. Because I have never... Situation. I have never got no free trip from them. So, nobody can say I'm a friend them. Look here. Because oh. you've been in a situation where something has not worked, does not mean it does not work. And again, which is why you see America working things out, switching things up and trying to figure it out. And they're doing it from early so that they can get things together. We're not yeah, saying Malik, just, somebody just randomly two, throw people in. We're not saying randomly throw people in, coach. We're saying start from early, string some teams together and see what comes out of it. And I agree with you. Where are the people? Why aren't they no, coming? What? Why, where are they where coming are from? The, no, I didn't say that. I said, where are the people? Why aren't they coming? Because we don't have we don't have nobody that can lead. And at the end of the day, every club determines what they want to do. So if they determine that their athletes are not running, then it is what it is. And J3 is just has to, uh, has to take the loss and take the L and go sit down one side. But let me so ask you something. Which governing body? I'm asking you a question. Which governing body? It doesn't matter the sport. I'm asking you. Which mm -hmm. governing body cannot govern the athletes that they are supposed to govern? I'm asking you that question. Look at it globally and answer my question. Which governing body is not able J3. to govern their athletes? J3. So why is it that every other governing body can govern their athletes but the J3 is? Uh, you ask me? I would want to know too. 
I would want to know why the clubs refuse to send them athletes. Really practice help you to still do speed work. Why we don't want to do it? I'm talking about risking getting injured. Really practice help with speed. We need to do it. Why the athletes don't want to do it? That, I, that, is the, that is the question I want to answer for. Over the years, we have difficulties in, 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 in securing people. People are going to camp late. People not show up. People this, people that. And then, you know what mentality we have? The mentality is that, oh, me used to do really a champs. That easy part I work that. I would not know it's a repetition now and very important something. That you know. Oh, me used to go champs. Me used to run relay. Oh, me used to do this. Oh, me used to do that. Them need to start it out. And, Listen, and... at this particular point, we don't need we don't need the J3As to say guys come to a relay. I would love to see MVP, Elite, Racers. Gosh, I always keep forgetting Maurice's club, Sprint Tech. I would love to see all of these people individually on their own accord, right? Just even if they're not running an individual event, just send them go on one relay. Four string to string together four girls and say go run. What is so hard in that? How is that so hard? Are they running every day in practice? How is I, that you, so hard? You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna say it out loud you know. Mr. Bruce James. You have been doing a tremendously good job in terms of the the trap meets, the velocity meets that are held. And you have a next one when you have all comers. It is so simple. We are doing it in our backyard. All we need to do is set up some teams to run against each other. You know? It's mind boggling. Easy, easy solving our problem that you know. So we now fear go so to Florida. Simple. We now fear go this we now, every me every week we have meet. The relays are speed work as well. They use it for speed work. It not hurt nobody. Not because hurt if you go cool. and meet, if you go and meet and run 100 meters, I the same thing I do. If you go exactly. run exactly, and if you're gonna get one. hurt there, that means you would have gotten hurt in training the same day anyway. <laughs> and a Which? World War Three starting up. Okay, Wait, seven, eight, 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 I've been watching them for years, and it's not a new thing. I've been watching them for years, and it's the same problem over and over again. Whilst America has had time to drop the button over and over again for the men, 100,000 times until they finally get it right, right? And for the women, consistent. well, I don't want to say consistently losing because we have traded loss, losses and wins with them, right? But, you know, they're at a point now where they're like, okay, this is what's going to resolve it. We need to make sure that we're, you know, ahead of it, ahead of the, ahead of the, um, the, 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 the scaling or, or whatever is going on with the relay and to select our team. We can't just wait until the last minute. Let's get in there early and get this done. And I think Jamaica keeps sitting down on the fact that we have the fastest people. What does all the, having the fastest people have to do with having the relay, running the relay? Nothing apparently, because I know they can't string together a relay and do much with it. So might as well, we don't have the fastest people. To, to this day, I cannot understand how Jamaica was beaten by three, four girls in 2022 that were nowhere as close to Shelly, Ilian, and Sharika. Yeah, we, but we still T, cannot believe. flat speed alone is not the only thing, you know. Precision. No, that's what I am timing, saying. The, you have to pass the button um, on a timely manner. Yes, outgoing runner, half a time in the person. Incoming runner, half a step on them side. Put up the button. The person will, like... will collect the button, have to do all of the right things. So, if, you know what if, it's coming if, like? 
politics, how I hear people saying how things are going on sometimes and everybody will be like, oh, nothing is going to change. Well, nothing is going to change because we don't demand a change. So let's let it stay. We're going to lose. If you all are fine with losing, okay, cool. I'm not fine with losing. So I'm, I'm visibly upset about it. But everybody else seems to be fine with losing. So, okay. So what, 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 what I'm going to do here now is that U.S. I go meet in a U.S. and I do it. And we have meet in a Jamaica and we not do it. But when me tell you what I go, go on, you see that team that we have got a, a something there really, eh? I bet you one club them all come from. Mr. Jeff asked the question one day if I know J3 or I club them. I believe the clubs have a lot to do with it too. But if 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 standard and policies are put in place that these at least have to follow, they would have followed exactly. it from day one. They would have followed it. So it still starts with the head. So yes, I agree that the clubs are part of the problem, but the problem is that there's nothing stand, there's nothing set for them to follow. There's nobody for them to follow, so they're doing their own thing. Uh, everybody, everybody, a friend, I tell you. I can't get back my spot. Over the years, you know, yeah. you see Shelly and in, um, um, what's your name, Karen and them people ago, when we have um, Jamaica versus the world, you know. When they look at some of my team, them, I think how much time Bolt ever got or something there? I think it's only once I've seen him. I don't know. All right. Every time team pick, I saw certain people I go. Politics. Yeah. Politics. I get that. I get that. I'm not so interested in, honestly, this is how I look at it. Pen relays, world relays. Honestly, they're just one-off events. What I'm most interested in and what I would love to see is at these local development meets, week by week, because we have one every every week, week by week, I need to be seeing these athletes rolling out and running relays. I don't but care don't who is on the relay leg with they you. They don't even have to run every week and can do it every other week. No, I'm not saying, no, no, no. I'm not saying the one set of athletes has to be running every week. I'm saying the meets are kept every week. So let me see y'all out there doing it. You understand what I'm trying to say? But nobody is doing it. And I'm saying, even if you don't want to run with, so let's say, for instance, we were a team like GB, right? And we only have four good girls anyway. And those are the only four that we'll be using. Then you may have to start to say, oh, well, I don't want to run against my competition because I don't, I don't want to run with my competition because I don't want her to know what I have yet or blah, blah, blah. How's it Kofat? Based on how these clubs are, are done in Jamaica, they can fill the whole team for themselves. I, as I said, they can fill out all eight lanes themselves. Man, they're not a vision. The other club they're running with them. The, pr the point is, let's get some baton passing experience going. We're not even going full speed, but let's get the technicality of the event rolling. Let's learn how to do this properly. But of nobody wants we, to do it. Of course, we can do um, um, dry run. We can't tell the athletes that they don't go full blast if people are going to worry about um, getting hurt. We can't tell them that they don't go full blast. Yeah, but they're not doing it. That's the whole point. And I fail to understand how Jamaica, we have so much club. We have so much athletes in every club. Can I, can I do this? When we see racers roll out them club, the, the, them, them athletes, when we see Sprint Tech roll out, and I think um, Swift did run out too, and probably our next um, club. Yeah. We need to see more people run out. And they you can't to... have them meet them alone and them run, and then you know, see them again. No, yes, so make it a consistent thing. Maybe not every week, but every other week or every three week or something. Mm. Let's get it practicing. You think, you think too, you think, you think set away, Bridget. Me not, me not like. not no lie, guys. When the Olympics rolls around and I watch Jamaica collecting silver, I'm going to just flip my laptop over on the ground. I'm not going to buy me one new. You hear, coach? So mm -hmm. Get ready to buy me a new computer. Because I'm flipping this one on the ground. <laughs> I'm going to take it up and start banging it. Coach, you're not listening. Yeah, me I listen. Me upset about but it you're not enter But you're not entertaining ba buying me a new computer. Me upset about it, man. If me not entertained by your new computer. Yes. I said okay. I'm going to flip this one up and break it up. <laughs> if I have okay. to watch us winning silver. Who, 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 if you make it to um, Rachel? 
it has seen a video now. So whoever dip on this will know them or have contacts with them. Just go tell them. Marcus. Oh, when Marcus says it's not beneficial, Marcus, what do you know about the relay them on the package? What they what the athlete them I get? What do you mean it's not beneficial? Yeah man, if we we can't we can't we can't we can't we can't fix um T T broken laptop easily, man. No, go and go ask Elaine. We collect the what she collect last year? The silver medal in the four by one? How mm. how important that getting that silver medal was? Go and go ask her. Since you don't think getting really medals is not important, go and go ask her. Only a fool will think that, you know, T. People don't understand the sport will think that, you know. Because... Go and go, go, go think said. Only thing said they, these people don't have clauses in their contract. Exactly. Gold medal they have gold clauses medal. in their contract and you sit in there thinking that a relay medal is not as valuable uh, well it's may, maybe it's not as valuable as an individual medal but thinking that it's not valuable is ridiculous and you know one of the next thing to where well, we not take serious this mixed relay thing like it's not a gold medal a world champion or olympic medal same way you know look on Brianna Williams olympic you know look on IW, uh, world athletics page Olympic two gold medalist. Time, two time Olympic gold medalist. One time world championship gold medalist. I saw a people in my call you as. So we need uh, to only cut Jamaica all this alone foolishness. have the notion, say, say they, they really are not valuable. It is valuable. And when, let me tell you something. With when you look at those contracts, stuff. why do you think that certain people are always trying to get their people on the relay? Why do you think so? Because they're able to get a contract out of it or get them to renew a contract or get something out of it from the sponsors. Yeah? Marcus, I'm not attacking you, sir. <laughs> I keep telling you all, when we talk about the relays, I get very, very heated. <laughs> People, when you don't take tea serious, you know. She does, she don't does. take any of my what I'm saying as any personal attack to anybody, but this she is just how I feel it. personally when it comes yeah. to the relays. And at this particular point, I am disgruntled and I'm not going to hold on my mouth and pretend I'm not disgruntled. I am disgruntled. I've been watching it for years. I've been watching it fail for years. We've been able to put a band-aid over a sore, but now everybody is getting their act together. We're seeing countries getting their act together. Plus, not only that, they're also getting faster and faster. They're fielding faster and faster athletes. So when we could cover it with, oh, we have the fast three or the fastest four so we can still win we can't do that anymore and still there is no attempt to rectify the issue hey you see right now u.s is setting up everything where they can forget all releases uh, all titles they say after bolding do a preview to the championship uh, at to select everything US. All right. From acting more to to Noah Lyles to 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 carry. carry. Uh, listen, a paper they want to scrape everything in the Olympics. And Jamaica play games. Joke thing with the fun man. I'm telling you, if I want to respect America, both. You see, when it comes to winning medals, them not play a game. You see, whatever beef they have behind the scenes, you see, when they touch the track, a different team, you see. You'll never know, so them have beef. Like sometimes I'm watching Ray, and he might talk about some of the beef them when them did have behind the scenes during whichever championship, and you would never know. Because when they come to the track, they're ready to run because they know that Team USA comes first. And as a matter of fact, winning the medal helps you. So I can't understand how winning gold medal is going to help me, help me make more money, just help me full stop. And I want to carry a beef to the track so much so that it doesn't, it affects our performance and we're not able to get this gold medal. For the life of me, I can't understand. You know, you know, when you go to work sometimes in your regular nine to five and you don't get along with some of your co-workers, but you still come together and get the job done. It's the same thing. But the business can fail because you're having your little personal beefs, right? So you're still going to come together and get the job done because in order to get the job done or, or sorry, getting the job done means you get paid. So my, my, I can't understand how Jamaicans can't see through that point. I don't care who is friends. I'm not asking people to be friends. I could care less. I'm saying 
come together and get this done. Do du- Vian, who has a um, bold record can break? People are talking, so they might break a record, no means so they might break it either. That's our next thing you have to, you have to go out there, go execute it. You, know. you think record is an easy thing for break? <laughs> Another thing, we don't love our country as much. You think so? I think so. May probably, yeah, I think may so. Probably, may agree. I think we're selfish beings. I think we're so, selfish. Innately, uh, we're me, selfish. But me say it, it long comes time, off you know, as though... Mm-hmm. I said it from the inception, you know, we have this selfish behavior individually. Are we competitive? I pretty much that me did I say, you know, we com- we, 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 we're competitive individually. So we care no, yeah, about we. We're selfish. We, we care about we, the individual. When they come on to working together as a team, no, that can see us a little bit. When a teamwork makes the dream work. Teamwork definitely teamwork. makes the dream work. I, when I think about somebody pointed this out in the comment section, Shakiri and, and Gabby, this was a whole big thing. I even did a video on it last year. And World Championship gone. Gone through the wind. We sit on a word about USA and food, food house are down. <laughs> no, it, Shem. What a piece of thing. It's not the problem mostly with the women, you know. Because the men, them not practice either. So it's an overall thing. Um, it's an overall thing. I'm not saying nay, but when we're talking about winning a gold medal, I don't think anybody has been saying that Jamaica is in the correct place to be consistently winning and we should win and how come we didn't win. You know, I may do a video and say that Jamaica has a possibility of winning in the, from a male perspective, but I'm not going to be questioning it when I don't see us win, say, how come we don't win, blah, 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 yada, yada, yada. When no, it comes to the women say, now, no, that's a whole different say, story. T, what she has said is that, the problem most that with the women where them have them on a, on a female issues and a, and a emotionally fight Look with here, each I don't, other I don't, I don't, I don't, I, 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 but I'm, I'm putting really. it past that answer. It is not that alone that is causing the team not to be performing because the men, they are not practicing either. So the two teams are not practice. So we can have single out issues with the female them have. And not talk about the, the greater issue of no practice, no relay practice. That are the, that are the main point for me. Of course, they have individual issues, but we still not practice. Asafa, you, you, um, you're saying all these people had issues off track, but when they came together to run, it worked, right? With little or no practice. As a matter of fact, let's just call it no practice, right? In today's day, it's even harder to construct a team because you're probably looking around and wondering who, what, where, when is going to make this team. A lot of the guys are new. They're very young, first timers, everything. So you have to take all these things into consideration as, as well, which is why, yes, the practice is needed because all these first timers, some of them never, I don't even recall some of them. Practice. Some of them went to schools that didn't even partake in, you know, like a big school where you could be a partner for relays. So some of them probably never even run relays in their life, right? So, with that said, yeah, then we need to practice for the men, clearly. But I feel like even when the men's the men have issues, they're able to put it aside and still run. You know what I mean? You saying and Asa for were cool. They were, but at the, I want to say a few times there were a few club issues. I would say I, I don't really want to bring it up, but yeah, there were a few things back in the day. I would let that just leave it at that. And um, yeah. All right, so we have a caller okay. on 9T. Um, Carla, welcome to the show. Yes, good evening. Good evening. I'm calling because I'm just wondering. Yes, thank you. I'm, I'm No, you, you, need to I turn, you need to turn on what you're listening. We're getting our feedback. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, let me turn it down. Let me turn it down. Yeah. I turn it down. Yeah, go ahead. Yes. I am um, I'm in agreement with both of you. Mm-hmm. If you're consistent, if something is consistently being done and the result is not yielding what you're hoping for, it tells me a lot of crazy ill people are running the, the show. You know, they said if you if you do if you keep doing something over and over and the, and you're getting the same result, which is losing or getting silver, it tells you that 
you need to rethink this because th the goal is not to get silver, although it's good, but the goal is to get the best out of all your efforts. And I'm, it, it, it's a, a bit of arrogance. I'm Jamaican, as you can hear. Mm -hmm. It's a bit of arrogance you know, and, and a foolhardy and a foolhardy thinking process that you can just get up one day, you've not practiced maybe once if you feel like it, and you go in there and compete with the best in the world. And America is, I, I did watch the same thing that you did with, um, what's his name, that sports caster, the Trinidadian one. Yeah, um, um, Otto Bolden. Bo um, yes, Bolden. I watched it today. And when I saw it, I said, oh my God, most of the people he identified as the world because he, he compared the world and USA. USA got six. The world got six. I don't think one Jamaican he identified in the world. They were um, um, the girl from Germany. Um, I can't remember her name. She, he had, I said, oh my God, she's been running 100 years and she's still good. But he identified her as one of the winners. He identified, um, but I think one Jamaican came up on his on the world section. So those six countries, those six world people that he said would 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 would, would uh, beat the United States, not one Jamaican is identified. And it, it aggravates me to know we have all this talent and we're so arrogant that we don't think we need to do it. Do you know anybody that has succeeded in, in business or in or in, in, in any field? That you just get up and say, oh, yeah, I'm going to do my presentation today. Or I am going to give my whatever today. And you think you're going to beat the people who have been toiling. And, and that, that a poem that said you, when you toil upward through the night, you're going to get the results. Mm -hmm. And just like, just like Miss T, yes, I'm upset. You can hear it in my voice. I, I religiously watch track and feel. It says, and I, even, oh, I, I do therapy. And when I on, on, on it, when they ask you, what is your interest? After you listen to all of your credentials, I said, I am a spectator athlete. That's what I put on it. <laughs> I love track. I don't love the field much. It, it's like playing golf. But I love track. It's boring. The, the field events are boring me to death. It's too slow. Takes too long. But with the track, you get the job done and you get your results. Mm -hmm. it's, it's, it's like... Um, you, you get your reward quicker. So uh, the, the, the Jamaican people who run this thing, that man, um, what's his name, Gail or whatever his name, yes. I saw him on some uh, no, shows yeah. this week. Yes, he needs, to, he needs to earn his money. He's, the, he's doing a disservice to the country because we're all setting ourselves up to, to, to oh my God, he couldn't do it. And Jamaicans are going to bash all of these people and that doesn't motivate you. Your personal achievement. When I saw what Cherika did last year, when she was looking around for Sherry Ann, what the hell are you looking around for uh, uh, for Sherry Ann for? Run your race. Sherry Ann has, has scored how many years over, over um, what's her name? Um, Jackson. Sherry Ann has been there 100 years. What the hell was she looking around for Sherry Ann for? So my thing is, if everybody is going to be selfish enough to say, Oh, I got my this already, or I, I beat that person. Then you know that you're not in this for for, for Jamaica. You're in a person, and, and I saw it in 2020 when they when they, they ignored what's her name, um, Hara. Um, they ignored her, and it was so shaming. I sat there and I was biting my knuckles, like, oh, you don't go on the world stage and do this to your own sister. She couldn't be that bad. Yes, yeah, she might have her ways. So do you, Shelly Ann. So do you, Sharika. What the hell did you, are you doing that with the other girl for? You come out of the same country. You wear the same colors. You talk the same way like me. Why would you do that? On the worst day, I'm not forgiving Shelly Ann and, and Sharika. Because they did her wrong. You did your country wrong. No matter how fabulous Shelly Ann is, they did uh, Billion wrong. And the world saw it. And when you, when you show the world that you are divided, any bad thing can happen because you have set yourself up for that. So let me get off 
<laughs> but I needed to say something. Uh, yeah, yeah, and I appreciate it. your call. I cut your num- number down and I had my son put it in WhatsApp because I don't know how all of that stuff yeah. works. But I thank you because I know I would have burst the night. So, T, I I got you. I know exactly how you feel because I love track. And let me tell you something. I, I, I've been living in America for 40 something years and I talk about Jamaica all the time. And let me tell you. People will say, oh, you're bragging about... Yes, I brag about Jamaica. If we don't put our own home, nobody else will. So those girls and boys need to go to France and toot their individual horns and toot one for the country. And the rest of us will cheer them on. Even when they lose. I thank you very much. Have a good Saturday night. And God bless you. You might hear from me again. <laughs> yes, man. If you need to call in more regular, man. <laughs> Big of yourself. <laughs> really? Yeah, I've been keep, I've never done this. I thought, you know, I've, I've never, never done, done this before. Crazy of a track. Yeah. <laughs> but I love it. I love what you do. And I love it when you're coming together in this partnership. Your ratings are going to go up. I know it. All right. Your ratings are gonna go up. So thank you. Have a good night and God bless you. Right. Listen, you need to write that man, um, Gail, and tell him to do his job. Tell him people are calling all from America to scold his ass because he ain't doing his job. He needs to do what the Americans are doing. Get your ass out of there and you work for your goal and you work for your, for your country. That's it. That's right. Tell him to do his job. If you're doing the same thing, if you're doing the same thing over and over, you're getting the same results. You know what it says in psychology? Mm -hmm. You are not mentally well. Mm -hmm. It means I need to change my my MO. Let's change my MO. Let me see if something else will work. And they've been doing the same dance foolishness. I couldn't get over when that little girl, Tuana, carry something or other. The girl can't run more than me. I should be, it should be Shelly and Shelly and was sick. But my God, when, when was it, she, the, the girl at beach, Sharika, what? <laughs> oh my God, I wanted to jump through the TV, I come grab her. <laughs> I couldn't believe it. No man, we can't do that. We, we're too proud. we too, don't you know, Jamaica is, is <laughs> You make me feel like we're doing something wrong. Jamaica is hot. Jamaica is the boss. You know, mustn't do that to the country. All right. Good night. Good night. Good night. Nope. All right. Think of yourself, Carla. What's her name? Yo, the Carla, you're taking night tea. I'm not like. Um, Hold on there, one second. I need to pee. Don't don't go don't go deep into what you said because I need to come back because I've been drinking too much water. One second. <laughs> Breaking transmission, people. Carla, big up yourself. Big up yourself for that. Expressing yourself. We appreciate that. You understand? Really appreciate it. You see me answer? We really, really appreciate that. And yeah, man, we, we are gonna see where we, we and Tia do some more collaboration. You understand? Um, when you look at it still, you know, you know, I check on feel um space. I mean, I do collaboration, you know. We are doing collab, you know. Mm. But the caller speaks some truth, man. The caller speaks some truth. You see, Master? Me, 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 can't, me can't talk how me feel upon the line, you know, because me now go get, me probably I get out of character and get loud and rowdy. So me wait till one time, me half of them space and me have reaching them attack, talk, can't feel and we start. Go on. Yeah, man. You see me I say? Yeah, man. She the name. You know, so the only thing I'm going to agree with you, do a caller, me can't say it. The only thing I'm going to agree with you is the video. That you said them are segregate themselves. You know, say some investigation was done into that video. Cause when you know the people me always are investigating. You know? I did some investigation in that video. I said, yo, what go on? Why what what this? What that? And I was told of the circumstances around it. You see me I say? So it had nothing to do with disrespect 
and it had nothing to do with any standoff between the athletes them. So let me just put that out there. It had nothing to do with that. So that I only part me agree. It 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 it, it, it came, came across that came way to the public, the public, but it was but not. It was not. The, the, that intention that was intention not really was what not really they wanted to happen. And I'm telling them, I do my investigation. And this is not a source. This is a direct source. <laughs> if you don't understand the verse. <laughs> Coach, your auntie. What did uh, I miss? No, we don't. 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 And, and get our emotions out there. You understand? Because a real thing, but we just say one thing, we never agree with her, is the standoff with the, with the ladies, the mother. When they the, 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 the medal collection, um, I think the whole grand scheme of things was, was, was misinterpreted. Yeah, man. And I, I, I just leave it at that. Let me swear people must say in the in comment section. Um, me start to say, we are Americans, Jamaicans born, but we are passionate about our country and team. Mike C, you passionate? And are you across the people that must say, nah, do this and nah, that. Mike C, careful in the Mike C. Mike C, careful. The de- lady licked the nail on the head. Yeah, man. Collabs, but no fighting coach. My auntie fight a, a, a play play fight, man. <laughs> Mumma go out with herself. True, we are expecting to win without much effort. The world is catching up. Exactly. And if we not take heed to all of this, we are going. It's like West Indies. Hmm. I say no more. I called it when T came on tonight. It was going to be epic. But you're not going to tell us, right, Coach? No, me not. Me can't tell you no that. You're mad. Me can't tell you no who me talk to and 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 the the, the, the real situation surrounding that no me not gonna tell you no the person would have the persons would have to come out and say not me coach you and tea are like bunny and clyde of chaka field keep up the good <laughs> tio you are rock sir you hot yeah, move like yeah, move like granny, you know. I'm just <laughs> listening to this disingenuous spiel and I'm just shaking my head. But anyway, disingenuous what? Spiel. From who? The boogeyman. Who is boogeyman? I want lady calling, you know. No, not the lady. <laughs> <laughs> Why would I call her a man? Are you crazy? <laughs> All right. But, but I said nothing. All right. I'm not a fuck. Say what you are saying. I have nothing to say. I'm moving on with my life. Okay. I know why you're not saying nothing, you know. Why me not saying nothing? NOJ says so she don't expect no better from coach. <laughs> People, me are telling you the truth, man. Me do me investigation about the situation. Honestly, a real talk. But me can't you know tell what you what. In life, this is the only thing I will say in life. Nobody is perfect. Nobody is expected to be perfect. I don't believe so. I I certainly don't have that expectation. But when you have situations and scenarios happening, you know, consistently. I will not say consistently, but, you know, more than once, let's put it that way, then it can't be just brushed aside as, you know, circumstantial for that particular situation. And I definitely think that at the end of the day, um, actions speak louder than words. I don't care if, about you explaining stuff away. Actually, I don't really think I care that much about it because it happened and I kind of just move on with my life. But we're not going <laughs> to... Ah, let me just tell you something. And I don't I don't know if, I'll, if people picked it up, but I'm going to tell you something. Whatever is going on in the Jamaican camp with the ladies is still a thing. 
because I noticed it. I just haven't said it. I noticed it down to when Jamaica was doing the launch, the Puma kit launch. I noticed it. So for me to even see it in 2024 tells you that this is a thing. I don't want us to think it's not a thing. Practically, when you notice, notice at the launch, tell the people they've not become really and truly. Launch, really and truly, I don't care about it because at the end of the day i'm not expecting anybody to be kumbaya i've never thought that people need to be kumbaya but we're not going to be disingenuous about what's going on i see it consistently these actions they're very subtle but they're there you know what i mean and for me for the for the most part as i said i don't care but when it comes to the relay i want you to put that behind you because it's about the relay and about the country at that particular moment put that behind you and go run i could not care i don't care if the person stole your man move on you know what I mean? Go run the race and move on. Collect your gold medal and your money and your whatever else. Yeah, get bonuses associated with the gold medal. I'm going to my big food and belch out the facts of your teeth, your man. So you know what I mean? I'm not saying one. somebody did that, but I'm just saying if that was the situation, go near my big food and belch out the facts of your teeth, teeth your man, your, your, your bank tall up. You understand what I'm trying to say? Me just, me just can't bother with this. So we're not going to be disingenuous, coach. That's all I'm going to say. Um, but anyway, let's move on to the next topic. So are you insinuating or are you saying that... The boogeyman is being very disingenuous. No, sir. <laughs> Look here now. Nobody... You notice I didn't say who I spoke to. It could be anyone, anyone, anyone of them, you know. What, is this, what does what I have to say have to do with Elaine? I'm, you see... You see, <laughs> I don't think you're smart. Who said that? So, what you, you ah. see, if you never read, if you never read the message and said that, nobody would see it or pay it. No mind. They would have no. Just see it in the I'm reading. Section. Go down. I'm always reading the chat. But it's interesting no. to me that you, the, the person, decided to pick out Elaine out of everything I said. But that's that's no, quite but interesting. No, if you if you never highlight it, the person would not get no highlight T. I'm going to highlight it. Why am I not going to highlight it? Because some are too disingenuous and it needs to be said. Some of y'all ignore... are disingenuous. Are you saying that I am disingenuous, genius, Steve? <laughs> no, let me ask you. Because what did I say that makes me disingenuous? <laughs> I'm have to defend myself, you know. <laughs> We're moving on. <laughs> B M no no at you tell her that. <laughs> you know what I find? I find that. that when it comes to some things, I don't know if it's no, a ma, female thing. Me no people of offense. Hold on, let me finish. Um, let me. Opinion. Oh, oh. Me no people right, so offense. I don't know if it's a thing with men and women, mm -hmm. where men probably don't pay attention as much, mm -hmm. and women probably pay too much attention. In the mm -hmm. sense that women seem to pick, well, I'm a woman and, and, and you're a man and you're saying, you know, something completely opposite of what I suppose um, most people are seeing. And it's interesting that it was a woman that was on the line. Right. So clearly, um, you know, maybe women just see and men just, you know, protect, um, want to ignore it and pretend it doesn't exist. I'm not sure. <laughs> no, 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 no. Listen, I'm, I'm telling us straight people. Because. When we have conversations, conversations, people don't even know, say, me know the intricacies are what really happen. And I can't say amongst the, among the ladies. See? Okay. Me know what go on. See? Okay. Before, I may see everything will happen upon the track. I may know things will happen off the track. See? See? Mm -hmm. But like I said, it is not my place to come and say things here. Because I have never heard anybody come in a this space come talk or something like that. So me I leave it. And if we start talk, if me start talk, there are going to be different views. On the, on the different individuals involved in the situation. No, if people are saying that, or if Tia say I'm disingenuous because I made a comment, 
the entire world see how the situation look. And that is that cannot hide. But I said I did my investigation. I did not tell anybody who me talked to. But me do my investigation. And I got my answer to what really happened. I do, I'm this go, is my thing, Coach. I'm, go I'm at the end of the public day. Either. Because I don't expect you based, to. Based upon what happened, it don't leave a bad taste in a people's mouth. So, in no make sense, that is said to try to fix up the situation because it done out there already. So, that's why I mean leave it. You see me, sir? That's why I mean leave it. But that's it. the whole point, though. That's the whole point. You leave it. Leave it where it is, off the track. You understand what I'm trying to say? Um, again, I couldn't care less. I don't care. I'm not expecting nobody to be kumbaya, right? But at the same time, um, uh, you know what? Let's just move on. I can't be bothered. I really and truly can't be bothered. Really, Ian? Ian. You think Shakira now about the team? Boy, I don't mean, I mean, know if I agree with you still. But let me tell you now. And, and that are the thing, you know, T. You see, women. Why? If a five. Women will be women. Women will be women. I get it. Yes. If a 500 years, females have an issue. Or what, 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 keep what, whenever the issue. They, them always are going to have the issues. So it, it's not like. You being in the same space, the same space I will cause the issue to go away. away. Women hold on to things. Women don't forget things. Sometimes I wonder if women really forgive. Because they are going to hold on it to the end. No truce. Nobody now be the bit. Why does it sound person. like you're. Why does it sound like you're, you're, you're shading me? <laughs> Why? Because I thought generally no boy. How I've held on to how I've held on to all my points this evening. And I have a and I have at least one point. If your conscience are it, then uh, you're up to it's you. It's not bothering me, but I feel like you're shading me. <laughs> no man, me just are talking general, man. And and it's his reality. Females not no Lego half stuff. You no know, matter what, they don't that's why I say I wonder if females even really forgive people. You understand? Or they pretend to forgive. Are them dust because they have to work with the person, they work with the person, but deep down, long they story the short, person. our word really is damned. So, when you look on the men's side now, a man and a man we have a problem and they argue and they fight. A man punch man in them face, see? And that go on. Yo, a man move on when he come on to work, you know. Woman, them not do that. Carla, welcome to the show. Hello, Mr. Coach. Hello, I'm calling back oh, because I Lord. wanted to say oh, Lord. one more thing. I want to say one more thing. <laughs> Is the mm -hmm. <laughs> Is there don't they have a, a psychologist on the? Isn't there some psychologist that they hired to um work with? It? With the athlete, I don't know if 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 they do that, you know. I don't know if they bring a sports guy psychologist with the team when they travel. Because that, because it it, be it would one look, I think, I think they would benefit from looking at it in a global sense, looking at it as a team. If they see themselves as a team, they wouldn't. Yeah, break up. Team, team Jamaica. They wouldn't be seeing it as oh, I am, I am the fastest woman in the world, or I have been in this thing for for ten years from. Apartment. Um, Carla, what, what? Tell us your name, so we can address up by your name. <laughs> um. Uh, if you don't want you to can call real, me Sonia. 
If you don't want to give I'm just real. trying to give you my pet name. I'll yes. give you my pet name. Yes, so if you don't want to give your real name, so people, just give us a story. Right. Name. It's Sonia. That's my real pet name. Okay, Sonia. Um, your, 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 your voice seems to be going in and out, so we're not hearing your arm um, clear. Oh. Like your connection is bad. Maybe because I, I have it on... Um... You're not hearing me? Yeah, I'm hearing you, but sometimes your voice go out. Oh. I just wanted to just say that the psychologist could work with them as a team. Or because you're listening to the um to the feed same time. You want to pause it or mute it. Oh, pause what what your the TV? Yes, because if you're listening to it, it's so like yeah, oh. yeah, yeah, um listen to what you're saying. Okay. Yeah, like you're yeah, pausing. All right, let me do that. Okay. I I just um paused it. I paused the TV. Yes. So hopefully that might help the listeners to hear better. Mm -hmm. Am I am I going in and out? No, yeah, you're clear now. Okay, maybe that's what was happening. Yeah, so if they see themselves as Team Jamaica, brand Jamaica, mm -hmm. they, they need to look at themselves, stop looking at themselves as individuals. You're if they were not with Jamaica and wanted to do something on their own, it couldn't be done. It's, they're representing Team Jamaica. That is true. In, in doing that, they would, they would then realize that as a team, if you, if you put all, all of your five fingers together, you create a fist which is stronger than one finger hitting you. If you so so with that fist, meaning a team focus, you can then be more powerful and be that power, powerful country that the world is. People are coming to Jamaica now. These YouTubers are coming to Jamaica because they see that Jamaica is is pumping up all their their uh, YouTube uh, uh, value. So they get all these hits. People from Africa, people from, from, from different countries are coming to Jamaica because Jamaica has something so special that we are not seeing, which is amazing. And if we just take that time to realize, you know, this is bigger than me, although I've been running since 2008 or 2000 what, you see this as bigger than you. And they need to see it that way. So when I see this division, when I saw that division in 2020, and I still think some of it is still going on, they need to realize they have a legacy, just like both was singing legacy for years. Mm -hmm. And that is, 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 is kudos from what he was pumping out on his, with his legs and with his mouth. These young ladies need to take a little page out of music. People might have thought he was super childish or whatever, but he was a self-promoter. But in in a in a very nuanced, um, not sickening like uh, Lyle's way. Lyle's, Lyle's turned me off, and I think he the Jamaican woman he has is only to get credibility because he knows we are so hot. That young and he's treating her good, and I'm proud of that. But the fact is, everybody wants to be got a piece of Jamaica, and these ladies are missing it. They are sh so short sighted that they're looking out. They're following the lead of one particular person. And that particular person sets the tone. Don't look at this person. Don't talk to that person. Don't be friendly with that person. When Elaine won in, in, in Japan, uh, or talk, yeah, in, in, in 2020, none of them went. The, the other two ladies didn't go over and congratulate her. I sat down. I was sweating. Let me tell you, I was sweating because I said, no, no. Don't do that. Go congratulate her. Go hug her up. Walk around with the flag. It was so obvious. It made me sick. Because one person. In, a, in, a, in her own silence. Dictated what the, uh, what the other girl Jackson would do. And Jackson followed it to the T. She didn't even say I'm an individual. Mm. I'll be here after that person retires. So let me then. Speak up for myself. Because I'm not sleeping at her house. She's not feeding me. I need to be my individual. This woman and I, I'm, I'm nothing with each other. If we even did, as T said, let, let's put it aside. Because we're representing Team Jamaica. Team Jamaica is bigger than me. My legacy is going to see what happened in 2020. And that will be part of the 
bad taste in Jamaica's mouth. So they need to look at what they're doing as bigger than themselves. And, and that is how you show your, your the legacy that a, a boat, boat didn't do anything so stupid. He might have issues with isophony. And I think a lot of it is coming out of jealousy. I studied behavior and I sat down here and well, watched it and I was beyond disbelief. So Bolton, because Bolton and Asafa did have issues? No, no, no. What I'm saying is they were both good. Same thing with um, Johan. They were all good, but I don't think they, the rivalry was there, but I don't think they showed any jealousy. But it was hot and heavy rivalry, which is what you need in order to be the best. You ha can have your rivalry, but you don't need to be snarky with it. And it was so snarky, I am sure no matter what language or what country it came from, and you were watching it, that is, you, you could be male, female, or in between. That is what was on the screen of my television and they would play it over and i don't even watch it i don't watch those races that jamaica has, has lost the one with tuana whatever her name is who, who was running the leg beside shelly and then the the, the 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 third leg and then Shari sharika i don't i don't watch it anytime i see it coming up i switch it and go to another one i do not watch it because it leaves me so disappointed mm -hmm. That you put your personal, it could be jealousy, but I'm just going to use that. You put your personal angst against another person, and it's almost like you don't want to touch the baton. You didn't want to congratulate her when the person won. You didn't want to, come on, come on. As, as T said, if you're working on a project at work, you know you have to produce because you're going to get your evaluation. You're going to get your evaluation every, every three months or whatever time your job evaluates you. You get your evaluation, and the evaluation is the medal. So you don't do those things. You cut off your, your nose to spite your face, and that's what they did. And they, they're setting the wrong tone for these these gorgeous, wonderful people I was watching in the Carifta. I watch it, and I keep watching it over and over and over, because I see, I said, oh my God, Jamaica has a chance now in the next two years, three years, five years. Because, and if, they, if these young ladies don't get some psychological team team help, it's going to translate to those younger ones I saw in Carista. And it's sad because the world wants to be us and we don't give a damn. We're going to make our personal jealousies and personal little petty little girl stuff get in the way of your legacy. And that's what I can't I fail to see why they can't see the bigger picture. They only see as far as it was the, the tip of their noses. No. They don't see beyond. I'm um, sorry. I don't think it's it a, I don't think it's gonna happen with this, it, it, the, the junior girls in the middle because I hope I mean, not because they might take the, they might take no, a man, cue man, from man. what they're observing. No man, they're not gonna follow that man. As, I, I, You're sure? Yeah. Then remember, on the females still, they're not gonna have a problem. Unless something arises, you know. That, but if they see, see what has happen. happened, they might see. If they, they see know. what they, but let me tell you, it's it's not like twenty years ago when you had no video. You just had to take what you. you it's so, little two minutes the United States give you on the TV. So two little you, minutes, so and you'd be you like, "Oh, let me play it again." Are you suggesting that because of um, them seeing that video, they are going to act the same way? Well, let me tell you something. If you see that and you can get away with it, why not? And you can still win your little silver medal or your maybe a gold medal. No, I mean, no, why not? Because I, you are bigger than you're bigger than Jamaica. I mean, I agree with you upon that, um, Sonia. May, may I tell you straight? But I, I mean, the things that them are watch something and just start act because them see that up. No. When we, so you're telling me that you think that this is by happenstance. This is by just chance that this this group of three ladies seem to be not getting along and it's and it's not little something that happened at the at the meet no. you saw it afterwards too I where she was she was she was at the it. um she was at the one in 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 oregon and you saw shelly and Stan, she did a little silly thing behind El elaine was looking at the, at the at the track looking at the field what was going on and she and sharika were behind shelly and and she, Shelly, um, um, she and she, she and 
Shelly Ann and Sharika were behind Elaine, rather. And, and Shelly Ann was doing the tipping, tipping up on her toes and acting silly. And, 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 and the two of them, uh, Sharika and Shelly Ann, were giggling and so on. But Elaine knew that something was going on behind her. And she, she was so disciplined that she didn't turn around to see what it was. And Shelly Ann kept making an, a, a fool of herself behind her, tipping on her toes and going on. And I said, girl, you're on the stage. Don't even if you're going through the tunnel or going back to the to the locker room, the cameras are there. They're recording you. Stop being immature. You're the oldest one there. You should have been setting the example for the two younger ones, Elaine and Sharika. You were standing behind Elaine, doing some silly stuff on your toes. And I don't know what she was doing, but they were laughing behind Elaine. And Elaine didn't turn around. I think this was one of the meetings in, in Oregon. Yep. And um, I think it's the same one where Sharika came, um, um, Shakari came in last. That was a, that was a meet. And I said to myself, "You are you are supposed to be the leader. Even if you don't de designate yourself as, you've been running this longer than these girls. All of them. You've been doing it longer. So Shelly and set the set the tone, set the tone for the other young people, so that they see. Then yes, I see kids who want to be like her." But they need to adopt those principles that make you a leader, make you a success, and make you have that long-term legacy without putting those little pimples, those little black dots on your record. We don't need that. If you, if if that is what you want to display and and show yourself as as, as a, a a model, you are the template for these younger ones. She's a template. She's done extraordinary. She is a template. And so what I'm saying is she needs to remember that. She can do her little antics in her house, in her backyard, in her car. Hopefully no cameras are there and the rest of us won't see it. But when you're on display and you have on the black, green and gold, you are representing every single one of us. How many millions of us around the world? We, when they were doing the soccer thing, people from Australia, people from here, there, they were, were coming out to cheer the, the soccer, the, 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 the reggae girls. So we are world, we are every, little, every little square inch of the world, there's a Jamaican. And we're proud, even though we can't stand some of the things that happen. We bust up Jamaica. So they need to remember that we are backing them. And so when you do silly little stuff you should be doing in your house, are you deaf on the world stage? You, it's, it's like taking a child out and your child do all of those things that they know they shouldn't do. And you'll be like, oh my God, you do it here in front of all these people? Come on. Come on. She need to set up. Uh, she need to she need to do the right thing so the younger ones will see her as a template. She is a template. But she needs to make sure she's doing those things that will set the stage for the next one to say, yeah, I want to be like this, 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 and this with, with Shelly Ann. Because I think she was the one that encouraged Sh Sharika to to be separate in that 2020 win when Elaine came first and she came as a second or third. They did not go over even put that hand on her back. I think it was, it was very delayed when they did go over and come back, but it, it was so half-hearted, you didn't need to do it, but I do it. When somebody, when you're really being forced to do something as, and you, 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 you felt bad that maybe because somebody must have whispered in her ears or something tell her, or go over there and touch her on her back. And that's basically what they did. They rub her back two minutes. Uh, not even not two minutes. One second. And they, she and the other one left. If you watch them when they run down and they win. And they run down to it with a flag. I was watching something two days ago. And Elaine, Sher Sherika and Shelly and were facing the, 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 the um, audience in the stand. And, and um, shaking hands and so on. And then Elaine came up. And as she came, like clockwork, they two the, and then turned up and ran. I was like, oh my God, you're a team girls, please. We're not blind. We're not dumb either. So they need to, they need, the psychologists need to give them some a team coaching stuff so they can see, because it's, it, it's a, it's a bad look. It's a bad look. Bad, bad look. And we get disappointed. When we see these things, when you darn well know better, 
You know better. You know better. No matter where in Jamaica you come from, you know how to put on your, your, your Sunday best and your Sunday self and you show off yourself on, on the world stage. That's all. That's all. Okay. I thank you for listening again, but I just think the psychologists need, need to give them all of them some good team team group coaching or team group therapy because this stuff needs to not be on the world stage. You need to keep that at, in our kitchen and cuss her off on the phone or just let it be. Life is too short. And as I said, these young ladies are templates for the young ones. I saw in Carista and the other ones like the twins and so on. They're coming up. You need to set the right example. That's all. Yes. I, I do therapy. I work in the school system. I was an educator. I'm doing therapy. I know these, when I see these behaviors, I said, you need to fix it. You need to fix it. And as, as the people who are forerunners for these young ones, they need, the kids are looking at them. The kids are looking at them, but I think they're wiser because they want the money. They're not going to act a fool for any silly little friendship stuff. They want the money and the money getting better. And I think they need to focus on how do I represent my, my family, myself, and Team Jamaica. Because all of us are applauding them, even when they don't come out in the right place. So thank you, and good night, Jamaica. All right, <laughs> good night. Bye-bye. Thank you. The comment section, I go on. Billy, I said, Billy, I said oh. hey, hey, it goes to show me, you know. Me, you People will like it today and tomorrow, then turn up, then turn up, you know. What does that mean? <laughs> the first call, everybody did like it. The second call, they didn't look at them. They oh. didn't appreciate the first call. <laughs> you know what I said? So, ah, you can't please Jamaicans, actually. Yeah, well, you know you, what I mean? You, um, you will get like today me, and tomorrow. You know, get like again. So, so I so we stay. But I mean, um, she makes some very good points. Still, you understand? Some things not for the other public, irrespective. Um, yeah. For me, um. I, I would have preferred, again, it, it be left behind closed doors because it's the stage is definitely not for that. Yeah. Um, what it does, though, is foster healthy rivalry. Um, I would say that because they all want to win, you know what I mean? So that, that will make the competition much more fierce. And really and truly, when you look at the greats in any sport, um, they don't really get along. When Kobe was at his highest, he was at it with everybody. He was at everybody's throat. And I keep referencing, you know, Kobe because I do, I do shock, reference Kobe, Kobe a lot on my channel because something. I love Kobe. You know what I mean? He was my favorite man. basketballer for me. So, but when he was at his highest, he was at it with everybody. You know what I mean? So, I, I fr frankly, I don't care. I, I, I said this before. I don't care if you're friends, yes or no. But I want when you come together to do a job. You come together and you do the job the right way. You know what I mean? And I don't want it to get convoluted by, you know, whatever else is going on. Because honestly, the world doesn't know what is going on. And, and, and honestly, the world doesn't care. The world just oh. wants to see you come out and perform. Compete. And just think about oh. it like any other job. Your house could be burning down. You know, so much things could be going wrong. You could be going through a divorce. You still have to turn up to work. You still have to do your job so that you can get paid. And that's how I look at it. Like, I don't care what's happening. You know, I don't care who started it. I don't care about none of this. You know what I mean? I'm like, yes, I see it. I don't want y'all to be kumbaya. I don't care that for you guys to be kumbaya anyway. If you are, if you all were, sure, great, lovely. If you're not, sure, great, lovely. But I want you to come together and run when the time is required. And that's one race. Oh my God, we can't get it together for one race. Child, we're failing. If we can't get things together for one race, then we're failing. Why would I block list the caller? <laughs> she has speak her truth. There's no so such me. thing. Hmm? It's the most annoying thing to hear when people say my truth. That's nonsense. There is the truth. Um, it is it is a terminology that they use in in in. No, no, no. It's a know. terminology for soft people of today's day because nobody mm. wants to take accountability for any of their T. actions, and everybody's like, "Well, this is my truth." T. It is a terminology <laughs> that they use in psych um fish um philosophy when i was going to school it was a big debate in philosophy class so don't tell me about the weak people
It's for <laughs> it, weak it, people it, that it take no accountability. You heard what you mentioned? You, mm-hmm. you mentioned psychology. It is a. It is for weak people. I didn't say. I didn't say psychology. I said philosophy. What you say? Oh, philosophy. philosophy. Well, okay, I couldn't care less. It's for so, weak people. <laughs> philosophy teacher that um, your truth is your truth. You don't have to believe what somebody else believe. That's I. I learned it in philosophy. Um. um no, no, no. So. It's not about what I believe. It's what are facts. So, say for instance, I throw the bottle over there. I can't come and t- and say. I didn't throw the bottle over there and said, well, it's my truth. I didn't throw it while you're watching me throw it. And you know no, but I that is it. different. That is you have evidence. You have evidence, T. You can't use evidence no, when you come on to something like that. So there's it no such thing as mine or yours. It has to do with belief. Okay. <laughs> That's good. I don't know what, it, what, what this means. <laughs> it has to be. May I tell you something? I challenge it to, you know. And I so come me, me know the statement. I challenge it in, 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 in the class. Listen, at the end of I the day, the truth it. is something that is factual. The truth cannot be something of, of what I believe and how I feel. If I feel um, happy today, then that's the truth. If I feel something else tomorrow, then I'm going to start walking up and down like a piggy and say, ooh, ooh, I'm a pig. I'm not a pig. I'm a woman. <laughs> yeah, you know, land will fight, fight. No, man, I'm not going down that, 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 that rabbit hole with tea. Um, half the year, me and I are going to discuss it. You see me, I say? So, I, 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 and, and that's why I'm not too believe in a certain things like philosophy. All, all psychology me challenge too. So, me challenge a whole of things. So, okay, and, and poor Jesha shares not getting no highlight. Hmm? Poor Jesha shares not getting no highlight. <laughs> well, isn't this a Jamaican channel? <laughs> <laughs> so <laughs> you know what uh, she get her light just hard <laughs> oh my gosh oh my gosh <laughs> but yeah man when, when I was going to college people I did a, a course called philosophy and all of them conversation they come up in it and me I tell you I challenge them something there. you see me I say I challenge them something there. and I was seen as the villain in the class because me now agree with certain things you see me i say so i want discussion where me like them discussion there still but me now me now me now go back in that conversation there again just you see here um for you get what were the first forms of numbers hmm? how were written how were numbers written first You was mean, it from Roman numerals? Um, that that's what I was told. No, the the reason I'm asking is because somebody said it's like looking at six and nine, um, from an opposite direction. But in my opinion, six is six and nine is nine. If you want to write two two well, number two numbers to look alike, hold on. If you want to write two numbers to look alike then that has nothing to do with how numbers were really um written and and i'm not sure if any number really looks like the other one how they were originally written you understand what i'm saying if you want to start conjuring up how n- numbers are supposed to be written today then sure i'm sure nine looks like six you know what i mean so again no, but when when i look at that you know to you if the person say i don't read the comment but if the person say it depending on where you're looking from that has to do with mm-hmm. um perception yeah. So from your uh, for your vantage point, so it has nothing to do yeah. with um truth or well, it could it could no, be no yeah, because it, I was saying it's truth. it's whether or not it's a fact, right? So if you oh. look at nine slash six in a different direction, you may factually see something different. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah, what yeah. I'm saying. But yes. in my opinion, based on that argument, I'm saying let's go back to what nine originally looks like and what six originally looks like. Then we can have a have a conversation. Yeah. But he um he said that oh so a Jew fart is put a comment. He said um that is not what he was talking about. So it's like looking at number six from two different um sides. The oh so that have to do with perspective now. And, yeah, so if you look at it from one angle, you may see nine. Yeah. Mm-hmm. No, I get so what he was saying. I get what he was saying, but I'm saying 
with things how with how things are changing now with meanings of words changing with everything changing let's 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 not conveniently use things we want to use to 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 make our argument and you know look at what was you know how things started originally numbers if they all looked alike then okay fine we can have an argument right but if they all didn't look alike and all of them but you know have some kind of distinguishment then we're not going to be saying nine looks um and six can be interchangeable depending on the perspective mm. Um, Mike, see, oh, my bias now. Bias. Go check your channel and see if I do a video upon it. So, I don't know, oh, my bias. Yeah, we are, we are going right, to end the show here now. Three hours. Yeah. And my head is hurting me. I haven't eaten anything. And I just got my lovely food that I'm dying to scarf down my throat. You know what somebody said to me on my channel? That I am, gosh, what am I? I don't remember. Let me tell you what this the person said. And I want everybody to tell me in the comment section if engaging with y'all the way I engage with y'all, which is being myself and being me and being authentic and real, is... Uh, what am I doing? Am I mocking y'all? Yes. Am I mocking y'all? Because I didn't know I was mocking y'all by, you know, being me. <laughs> I do agree that them. I have... I do have... A very interesting personality, I would say that, and a very weird sense of humor, and you have to understand it. I have a pretty old school sense of humor. Um, for new school people, they're pretty they're pretty much soft and they don't get it. Um, my sense of humor, but it is what it is. I'm pretty much harsh and straightforward, straight to the point. Um, but I'm not mocking anybody, so it was weird hearing that I mock people. You know what I mean? So anyway, I just wanted to know if y'all got that vibe. But yeah. Um, Mm -mm. Opinion, <laughs> See, sometimes really. you're annoying, but you're okay. I get that a lot. Sometimes I'm annoying because I never shut up. I know. <laughs> I can take that. I can take being annoying because I never shut up. <laughs> so you, you, that means you're talking and you're asleep. I've never heard that. <laughs> no one has ever told me. You say you I never shut up. Me. See, I'm like, I never shut down the computer. So <laughs> no one ever talking and you're asleep. <laughs> Uh, Nikisha Price, Rochelle Clayton, Stacey, Daniel. Yo, we are telling you more things every time about the other media. Yeah, and we're going three hours. Anyways, I'm not staying with you no longer still. You see, man, sir? We might have to do it. Tuesday, I come, man. We have to leave something for Tuesday. You understand? Yes, I'm the Howard Stern. Exactly. I'm that person. Thank you, Ian. I appreciate it. T can't take strong commentary. What do you mean I can't hey. take strong commentary? Hey. I just don't hey. like hold losing. Hold on, T. No answer, no answer, no answer, no answer. Don't answer, T. Hold on. This are the CM Rocky Hill. We come make some comments. See? I went Thursday never have a live. He makes some comment and we rush him. And say he might go up a hill. He's having a rocky time going over the hill. And the man start going and feelings, you know. And then he might talk, say, yo, you block him. And race take, race take, block him and all of them something. I'm saying, but now block you over here, man. We'll just find you. I know. We have That's what he's in his feelings. And him attack say, no, you can and uh, him can manage it. Hey, Raquel, don't make me start for you tonight. Because you, know? <laughs> you can't manage pressure. People love tell me, you know what people love to tell me as a fe <laughs> because I'm a female, I get so emotional. I'm like, have you all ever sat down and watched men watch football? Have you ever sat down and watched men watch cricket? What do you call that? I'm I'm, I'm curious, coach. Yeah, it, it's sad how, 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 how people define emotions, you know, and and think that emotions is if you're not laughing and and you know and if 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 you're not laughing then that's simple. If well, if you're laughing, that means you're not exuding some sort of emotion. You are. Not only a sad face is an emotion, you know. Not only when they get cross is an emotion, you know. But people envelope but it's the intensity being... just from partaking in in watching the sport. Just the in what, exactly. what, what it doesn't matter what type of emotion is being displayed yeah. at the moment. It's just intense, right? And mm -hmm. I'm like, I'm the same type of intense when it comes to track and field. It's just that it's not football. It's 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 track. So maybe y'all, some of y'all are not used to intense, you know, this type of intensity when it comes to track and field. But look here, I'm giving it to you how I feel it, and I feel intense watching it. So I'm giving it to y'all. Yeah, testosterone and, and, rage 
Exactly. And we think that that is not emotion. That is emotion as well. Emotional because you can't be objective when it comes to J.A. and Elaine. <laughs> Anyways, me no, me no want, me no want, me no want. Going at a part of a conversation. Anyways, people, big up on yourself. T, thanks for joining. Hey, you know, so we we'll start do this more regular, though. Do what more regular? Joining I haven't seen you on my channel. Live. Huh? When have you been on my channel? I've been on your channel so many times. When have you been on mine? When you have Ask your him, life. coach. Ask the huh? uh, chat. Ask him when he, when has he been on my chat? I have been in your comment section, but no, 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 no. That's life. not the question. Ask. I said, when have you been on my live? You realize how I come over here and I say, hey, coach, can I get on? When have you come on my channel and said, hey, T, can I get on? Okay. All right. If you, are you waiting for... for me to invite you? Hold on, yeah. coach. Are you waiting for me to invite you? Well, uh, no, it's not going to well, happen. Uh, no, no, me not, me not, me not. We're we not, we not stay them with there. We're not stay them with there. We're not looking at beggings. You see me? What I'm saying, going forward, when we have a live, we're going to just drop the. Um, so when me start a live, I'm going to ensure that so I send you the link. So you come on, yes or no? When you start a no. live, Make sure no. you send me the link. No, you're not going to you're not going to move the goalpost and talk about oh we're going to send people links. Come over on my live and show some interest and say hey T, I'm interested in this conversation. Let me get on and tell you my so, thoughts. So hold on, so hold on, hold on, because you do it that way, then me if you do it that way, then. No. Yes. No, I know so life go. And I shall not accept this, anything else. This is not part of, This is not. This is not um, Burger King where you want to have it. I am way. not mm -mm. accepting anything else. No. So because you come in at the comment section and say it, so me if you follow, me not follow people. Sorry, me not follow me people. Me not nah, nah, accept nothing else. So you're not gonna this, be on my program. Unfortunately, guys, you're not gonna see him on my program. No. Yeah. People never see me. Huh? No. No. Make sure to. She. She's going to have to. Let me on when me knock on the door. That's exactly that's what I'm telling you to do. Knock on the door, but you refuse to. You just said a no, while ago that you're not you're, going to. You're coming at the yard. Me, I'm gonna knock on the door. What do you mean? <laughs> the comment section is the yard. Me, I'm gonna come in at the yard. So, where are you gonna knock on the door? <laughs> I'll find my way to knock on the door. Okay, I see. <laughs> 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 but what me I say still, don't expect me to do the same way or you do it. You see me I say? Because two different individuals. Nobody not hear what you say. 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 Who knows? Who knows? It's a shit I'm here to learn so nobody not hear <laughs> That means that we know for here. <laughs> Don't repeat. <laughs> but not repeating, but we're not inviting you either. So it is what it is. But you repeat, God, that's apartheid. No, that's not what I was saying. I was saying something else. But yeah. I, don't, I was just going back to my first thing and I was like, I'm not inviting you. So it is what it is. No, you're not. All right. So we're not going to do that. But I'm going to be on. I mean, now I'll take the same route where you take. You see me? I talk with that. But it doesn't huh? involve me saying anything to you. What? I said, good luck with that, but it doesn't involve me saying anything to you. No, you don't have to say nothing. Okay. You don't have to, you don't have to speak, you know. You just have to act. <laughs> I feel like this conversation is going someplace else. Isha, get out of the comments. <laughs> Look like live lock out, lock him out of the house. What? Look like T lock him out of the house. So coach, you gave to knock on the door. No. Oh my gosh. Mm -mm. All right, opinion. Yeah, man. T and coach reminds me of Crystal and Ryan. Yeah. What is that? Um, you know three that fight, is? three fight in a one night. That has to be a record. We did a fight, you? No, we, we were. The, the first round, the first round sounded like a strong conversation, but fight. 
We're having a healthy discussion about track and field. This is how sport it, goes. It is robust. I, I, I find it so weird. Emotions and I know are going to flare. You watch a lot of other sports. And I know how you see people have discussions around surrounding other sports, especially when they have strong opinions as it relates to whatever their point is. Nobody's backing down. So don't expect any of us to back down either. You know what I mean? It's track and field, but it is what it is. It's sport. Straight. And we, we, we agree on some points too, and we disagree on some points. That is what makes conversation interesting and robust. Okay? So, again, Jeff, big up yourself. You understand? Big up all our people in the chat room. Stay. Big up to T again. And we're not going to see me for a fair show. You see what I say? Thursday, Thursday, Thursday. See? My show is not even, my show is not even Thursday. I'm not even new. Jesus. Wednesday, Wednesday, Wednesday. <laughs> Sorry. Why, <t> <laughs> why, me, why me talk about Thursday? Why Thursday come up? Because I have one show Thursday. No? Anyways. Gordon. And... No, 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 no. Ian, you're, you're wrong. Somebody delete Ian comment. Quick and fast. Quick, 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 quick. Oh, no, delete it, man. Delete Ian comment. J. Ross, delete Ian comment. Quick and fast. Ian. You have committed the ultimate sin to actually lighten me. I don't know I have, about tea. I have quite. I have a lot of seasoning, so I don't know what what I must what I must smoke. I'm not mayonnaise. So I don't know where you come to ask it, Ian. Somebody delete Ian comment now, quick and fast. One well, moderator, delete that. That not plain. Bridget, you know how people in despise that channel that I say. Me come, no, sir. You want me to unblock your Rocky Hill? All right, I'm gonna unblock you. I'm gonna look for you and unblock you. <laughs> All right, Ian, big up yourself. People, stay safe. Stay safe. Next, Next Wednesday, Wednesday. on August 6th, me, Panty. All right? All right, Tuesday, we don't know if Tia come on, but, come on, but. we got up to, I'm sure. No, Tuesday it's just that, you see, when it comes to me doing lives, I don't know what to do anymore. It's like I'm confused. Like, I have my scheduled day for lives, and then I, I, like, want to do lives, but then it's like it doesn't work out. Either the meat don't start when it's supposed to start. Stuff just don't look like it's working, so I'm like, all right, let's just go back to my Wednesday thing, you know. But I want to do mm. more. I definitely want to do it, especially follow-alongs, um, or watch-alongs. I want to do those more, so. But um, I suppose when the Diamond League starts, you'll be seeing more of that, for sure. Um, Nolan, yeah, man, we're going to try to do that. Um, them say you don't know, unblock uh, Rocky Hill. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I'm in my feelings this whole time. Every minute him calls me. <laughs> you know, I make your show interesting. Okay, fine, Rocky Hill. May I give you a chance. May I go unblock you. May I go see it go. All right, big up on yourself, people. Stay safe until next time. Peace out. A long time. We are say after 17 minutes, we are say we are going away. No, it a up now. Your style and your flavor make the city rock. They must say the season come out with a bang. Coach Minzy, best round here. Remember that.